Esa niña no se aguanta, ey, quiere todo porque el pussy sabe aguanta, ey. And we're back. We're gonna start right away with my boy, Duno. I I'm wanna here. know. Ask her titties for the shot. Love titties. There you go. Yes. Wow, I think that's the first guest who's ever chose titties. Okay, go ahead. What did, um... Which bottle you want? What did Chickies and Jenny choose? Um, shit. Wait, did I ask them? I, I feel like it was like, the last one I, that I asked was like, uh, um, Lauren. Before that, wait, did I? I think Chickies, yeah, but not Jenny. Oh, yeah. No, with Jenny, we were already drinking before we even started. I seen, I seen the clip when you were like, hey, are you drunk right now? You're like, she's like, I'm crossfader, fool. <laughs> yeah, like, I was like, <laughs> bro, we were fucking lit. And I was trying to keep up with her, and that bitch can drink. Yeah, man, shout out Jenny, man. And one superpower that Jenny has is that that bitch will go throw up real quick and then come back and party like nothing happened. And I'm just like, bitch, I'm so faded. Like, you do that too? You know what's funny? The homie started laughing because I'm, 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 I'm the... I feel like me, like, like, see, now that I know that about Jenny, I feel like me and her are, like, even more cool than we when we already are. Because I'm the type, like, if I feel drunk, give me a second, I'm going to go stick my fingers in my mouth real quick. Jesus. I'll be right back. Jesus. Hay limón si quieres, hay squirt si quieres, lo que sea. Squirt is fire. Every time, like, you know what's crazy? Every time I drink squirt, it reminds me, like, just Paloma vibes. Dude, did you hear my verse on fucking Margarita verse? I'm going to play that shit. Shamelessly plug. You know that one Margarita song, right? Uh, Which one? Give me one margarita. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. okay, so I did an official remix. So she's coming to my show to perform it with me. Okay, fine. And so I mentioned a Paloma, but you gotta, you gotta give me a live reaction by Duno. What you think about my verse? No, nope. like a lot of people didn't hear it, but like you Has know, she liked it. Yeah, but like it was just more like they had all the remixes. It was kind of like far. Like by the time that they got to the Mexican remix, it was like. The song had, you know I, what I mean? I, I was thinking, I was, like, I was like, I was like, damn, how many people did a, a remix of that song? That's what I'm saying. Like, they did like the gay one. They did the this. They did the, you know what I mean? It was like, it was a lot of different ones. And then it's like, they're like the, the Mexican one. And I was like, <laughs> oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? I like that. That is fire though, because shout out fucking Palomas. Guys. Right. Palomas are the fucking shit. And also, I feel like, you know, if people are going to hype up Margaret, Margaritas, I need to put Paloma in the conversation the same way that whenever people talk in Taco Tuesday, we need to put in other Mexican food so that, you know, people could just appreciate and expand their appreciation you for Mexican what? food. Shout out all those videos of the foods just making a big ass jar of alcohol. It just looks so good. The fact, the way they grab the squirts and they're just like, bro, Ugh. you haven't gone? No, I haven't gone. I'll take you, fool. fool. That's a little güero and fucking in tequila. Like on the way from Guadalajara to tequila. I mean, it's a little hot right now, but. Let's go. I've told you, we, we're we supposed yeah. to travel, bro, because I just uh, I just want to travel with just me and him and go some stupid fucking place because I know I, we're going to argue and we're going to damn near hate each other, but I was like, yes, no hard feelings, it. bro. Because I remember you were telling me, you're like, you're like, fool, I just be going to Mexico and getting lit. <laughs> and I'm like, that's fucking sick. Yeah. That's how I be, fool. Whenever I'm going places, I don't, I don't, I'm not from, I'll just go over there and get lit. Like, I want to pop us and be like, we want to Baja Beach Fest. Mm -hmm. Fool, we're fucked up. I'm dead. Well, yeah, like we were saying, you fucking, if you go and you throw up and then you come back, I mean, that's cool. That's lovely for you. But like, damn, that's unfair to the person trying to keep up with you. Because I'm like, you're here like, in my mind, it's 15 shots in. I'm faded and I'm not, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't uh, go into the bathroom and do my things. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, I'm just you. faded, about to pass out. And everybody's like either throwing up or doing something else. Everybody's hype. It's five in the morning. They want to go to the homie's house. I'm like, bro. Then they're like, snow's a fucking buzzkill. I'm like, bro, I'm fucking tired. Like, snow doesn't keep... do snow, you guys. I don't. I, you know, I wish I did. I'd be a lot skinnier, I think. <laughs> I wouldn't have to be starving to fucking. I wish I did, bro. I got, look, my heart has, like, I, I my heart beats too fast. And I'm, I have anxiety. I, I'm on the spectrum a little bit. Like, I, you know, I got a lot of things going on. I can't I like how you're just like pointing out everything. You know, like, you're like, oh, I'm, I'm a little slow. I, I don't do cocaine. <laughs> like, I'll be way more sexier. Like, that's, that's fucking crazy. You know, but see, I hate drinking with fools that do the, you know, the, the fucking thorny. That, that partake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because... Like the next day, like they haven't slept and then fools are just like, oh, fool, you're lame, you're full of sleep. I'm like, no, I just didn't fucking cheat, dog. Mm -hmm. Like I, I like doing shit how, how it was meant to be. I don't like taking shortcuts or yeah. short lines. You know what I'm saying? It's just strictly just, you know? Yeah. And, then, and, and it's just not fair. Them fools are awake all night. They remember everything. They take right. about 30 <laughs> shits. Like, I'm like, fool, why don't we all just black out as a team? And then, so none of us can remember. So you don't got to tell me how much of a piece of shit I was the, the day before. What's that saying? What was it? Thomas Je ben Benjamin Franklin? Who said, like, to trust not the man who remembers everything we said last night or some shit? It's like some fucking quote by one of the forefathers. That shit should be in the 
fucking independence of uh, the, the declaration of independence because i agree i hate when bitches be like you know what you did last time like bitch how do you fucking remember like don't do yeah, that because like, because that means you weren't in the same level i was in yeah like i would thought we was here and now i'm like you just peeping what i'm saying so well, you, you know can what i'm being it. a hypocrite because when i remember everything in the homies don't i'll be like damn fool you're scared like i like and then i just make them like throw all our whole mariscos eating or ota eating thai food i'm just like Nah, fool, you be trip. Like I just making. What sign like are you? Shit. A Gemini or something? I'm a Pisces. You're, oh yeah, that's right, a Pisces. Huh? Well, yeah, emotional. Look, mm -hmm. I fear the man who drinks water and so remembers this morning what the rest of us said last night. Yeah, see, Benjamin Bedix. fucking Franklin, bitch. Bettis, you got a blackout next time, Bettix. <laughs> the homie better be like, nah, fool. Just remember what Benjamin Franklin said, man. That would better be like, nah, for you fought like 30 goats and two horses. Well, why'd you do it? I'm like, fool, why didn't you fucking stop me? He's like, it was fun. Right. But I'm like that too. I like seeing the homies like, I'll make the homies, I'll like instigate when they're both inst like super blacked out. Okay, like, if I hang out with you, don't instigate other bitches to like you know, fight no, no, me no. or do something. But it's different. Like, I, Cause I'll be like, oh. Cause I, Cause I think with girls, it always just goes to another level. I think with guys like the homies could get down and wake up. I don't. I don't know how. I've never had the homegirls fight and then be okay the next morning. Because with girls, it's like there's so much more that goes into it. A lot of bitches scratch, pull hair, like wigs are falling off, bleep, like fucking weave, like all kinds of shit. Like you know, like like a chunk of your hair. Like it just be. It just goes there. I feel like with dudes, they just like, <laughs> you know what I mean? And I don't know. You wanna know the funniest thing ever, Beto? Beto, where were we when when you got that with Sovic at, at Lucy's? Oh, we're a big union. Wait, there's a mic right there. What? You be fighting? No, he just it was like the most stupidest thing ever. About to get the mic. Okay, so here I'm just saying I think I'm shy, but like you're shy, <laughs> man. You not even on camera. You can say whatever you want. Uh, we were. He'll just be at, a mystery man. We were at um, we're literally at a fucking like, like like a fucking just like the one of those spots that's open 24 hours, and we're all sitting. I'm sitting. Oh, he was there too. <laughs> Hong Kong? No, no, no. We're <laughs> we're in Pico Union. Our Pico and Union. In, in, in LA and we're chilling for we're just eating and the hump and right there they give you like your soda but like in a bucket you know like mm -hmm. for no like a bit like a tope for no fucking reason like the, the foam cup like the foam cup you know what I'm talking about but why though does I don't it have know, anything they just in give it? you the soda so then so then the homie Sobek's about to eat his food and this food comes and like necks him but he's not but we do that all the time and he was drunk so he just grabs his bucket of soda <gasps> and he just pours it on him and he's like fool now we gotta get down. And they just cut down for like 30 seconds for no reason. Just like a quick And they, they little... were just over it after 30 seconds. They like went back to eating. They were just like. He spilled the whole soda on me though. Yeah, yeah, but that's why. But, but it was funny because they like, it's not like, no, nah, I'm leaving. Fuck you. Like, like they were just like, all right, fool, don't do it again. Okay, don't do it again. Don't neck me next time. All right, and then, oh, tacos. Hey, let's keep drinking. Like, the conversation was over right after. I'm dead. And then I've seen my homegirls argue, and to this day, they don't talk. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it'd just be wild. I mean, but, you know, there's there's those type of things. with There's there's some things that girls can do that guys can't do. So it just, you know, it, it goes neck and neck. <laughs> you know, you get it? Facts, yeah. Because he necked him? Yeah. What the fuck <laughs> is necking? Like, what is um, that? Slap his neck? Slapping the shit out of the back of the neck. God damn. I mean, yeah, I could see why that would be... Like, nah, nah, but it, but it's just like... But it's normal to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, yeah, because we play like, like that. So like, it, so like, even in high school, uh, for how many used to play rub your dome? So like, if you like, if you sit down without rubbing your dome, like going like this, they could come back and slap the shit out of your, slap the shit out of your head, and you can't get mad. Aww. I mean, that's... So you have to do that every time you sit down. No, nah, well, like in high school we did it, but not now. Oh. <laughs> but but there, but but my friend group does have like really unwritten rules that like just between us. <laughs> but when I want to know when what's the moment you come up with those like does somebody go like hey guys I got a new game or like how do you guys how do you guys come up like what's the moment so, you guys decide that so I'm I'm trying to think of like now like we're really big on C check like you know how people are like shocked and like like even like at your college like okay okay cool you have another chair we are huge on the C check like the homies have gotten into it over C checking like oh like hey full C check fool like. Like, like, hey, if I called it and don't, don't start arguments, all right, watch, remember that one. And then there, is, but there has to be a witness to your seat checking. So let's say me and you are sitting right here, right? Mm -hmm. But there's the good seat, there's a comfortable seat, the, mm -hmm. the thing goes up right here. And if I say seat check and they go sit down and you don't confirm that you heard me, 
Mm-hmm. Then my then my verdict is out the window. They win. Yeah. Automatically. But, but now you got beef with me because you're gonna be like, you saw you're it. Like, you you saw not. me say it. So then so like the homie DJ, he's always with his girl sitting not next to each other. So sometimes he'll he won't say it and she'll be like, he did. But then she'll be lying. I'll be like, fool, you didn't say it. I'm dead. So but who's like, trying to sit next to his girl? Like that's No, no, but it's just it's just like <laughs> they might have the better seat sometimes. Okay. And it's like, nah, fool, like we automatically you guys win. do a lot of activities. That sounds great. Like I like I don't think we do enough stuff that like we're or have that many friends that like we're like seat checking and all I that. Have that many seats. I'm like we went to fucking we went to the movies last night to watch Five, Five Nights at Freddy with my son and my brother and we all had the receipts. No, <laughs> I mean, no, technically we popcorn seat nacho. Check, we, we had to pick. We had to pick. We did because my because Baby Drew wanted the popcorn. Like he's like, if there could be a way that the popcorn is where I can reach it, and I'm like, that's on me. But I have the nachos, so I'm good. So I get you. No, yeah. So it gets it gets it gets very intense. Like I'm trying to think of another one. What else do we have? Um, Bedex and DJ. Did y'all do the doorknob? But wow. again, you didn't answer my question. <laughs> what do you guys have a committee? Do you guys talk about what? There's the definitely new rule? rules in the friend group. But when did you come up with it? Like, do y'all have a group chat? Like, hey guys, so yeah, so we have group chats for sure. But I'm like, what's the moment that you remember instilling these rules? Like, if like seat check, did y'all have a conversation about that, or did it just start between two yeah. people and it y'all just, are just like, this is what we do now? Huh? Yeah, yeah, We're cool. yeah. Like, like the confirmation, we gotta be like, oh, like. We're like, oh, somebody's got to, we used to have a lot of fights, so we were like, oh, yeah. Yeah, somebody has to confirm right. that you said it. So, like, seat checking is starting. Oh, like, so it starts by a fight, and yeah, then like, you're like, all right, from our, now on. Yeah, so we exactly. can't break this rule. Okay. So even, like, um, even, like, when, when, when we, people suck at selling. A lot of my homies don't know, believe in Zell. And, oh. and so now when you Zell, like, now, like, let's say I put my card, I won't put it until everybody sells me. Then I'll put my card because they fucking take that. But it's vice versa. Like, sometimes I'll be like, oh, I'm paid to fuck that fool. Like, I'm not going to sell. Oh. DJ, terrible fucking zeller right there. Him and his fucking <laughs> girl are not a fucking sell. So, so now it's like. I love that. So, so now we're just like, you got to fucking sell. Or what just are you? It's just like the littlest thing will start a, will start a fucking argument. Like, if, like, if I like. It, but it's like funny shit. It's never that serious. Yeah. The C chick gets pretty serious when we're like, the homegirl Maria is like a pad we really kick it at. Mm-hmm. And like she only has a certain amount of chairs, and if you don't hop on them, <laughs> it's it's a wrap. You gotta you gotta be careful, or you can't call seat check while you're standing up. Okay, yeah. Like I can't be over there and you see me walking to your seat and be like seat check. No, you gotta be sitting on it when you call yeah. it, and then your seat is secured. Well, it's a five minute minimum. Five minute minimum. Oh, you have to have been there for five minutes. Yeah, like you can't just sit on it to yeah, call it and dip. And it, yeah, like. And then that. you have that seat for the night. No, no, no. Well, how long does well, that like, seat check last? No, so let's say I get up to go get uh, one of those boxes. And even right after I just sat down, like, oh, shit, I forgot my phone over there. I go over there and I didn't call it. It's, it's, it's up for game. See, <laughs> I love this. Like, like we do need rules. Because, like, for example, with that zelling or whatever, like, like that's cool. I've, I've thought about that before. So before, like, I've gone to a club or whatever and they're like, they, you know, maybe they're like, I don't know who the fuck you are, bitch. So then I'll be like, oh, okay, bet. Like, okay, so I got to buy a table. But I'm like on a date and like maybe like w- like one other person, it's three of us and now we got to get a bottle. I'm sure y'all have been like, yo, everybody's sell me. I got my card, blah, blah, blah. Me, it's like, I'm just taking the fucking hit. That's crazy. I need go more ahead, friends so ahead. that I can have that type of environment. So I could be like, yo. We need a double date, bro, or something. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> she, she, she oh, my like, God, man, damn. See, also, like, not like that, but we, the homies know there's money in my bank account. So if it's a big check, they just go like, do no, what's that you? That's what I'm saying. And I'm like, you motherfuckers. Right. It'd and be then like, be you like, got that, right? But then, but then I do shit like, all right, you fucking, you lagged it. So today they're going to pay my apartment. They've oh. been lagging on sale. So today they've been driving with me. I feel they, that. But yeah. Hey, that's very Mexican of us, right? Because somebody was saying yesterday, I was on live on TikTok or whatever, yeah. and they were like, yeah, well, you know, if it doesn't work out, then maybe they were just using you for money. And I'm like, I got to be real. I have a rule, a way that I make sure that like people who try to date me or are or do date me aren't using me for money. If you stay over at my house more than two times in a row, you're doing shit around here. Like, what are you doing? You washing dishes? You cleaning? You fucking, we, you helping me? I've had one girl help me paint the fucking walls. I have one girl. Food. Like, what are we doing here? Like, the bed, definitely, if we, if you sleep here... Two nights in a row, and I and the bed's not made like I like you know what I mean. Especially because I'm like I'm a gentleman, so it's like I'll pay for the food, like yeah. whatever, it's all good. But it's like damn, shorty, if that's not even your instinct, I'm not saying you got to be a maid, you don't got to do shit. But I'm saying, damn, you didn't even want to. That makes me be like, but you want me to fucking pay for that fucking steak, don't you? You yeah. know what I mean? Nah, like, yeah, definitely, definitely. Like if I wake up, like especially like like you know we film and do like yeah. we're kind of we just gotta always be at a glado some yeah. type of way. If I go in the shower, by the time I come out, my best should be ready. 
Yeah. Like my best should be made. At least you could do it like you just got some dick. You just, you know, we ate good yeah. yesterday. You know, we had a fun time. Like at <laughs> least up. at least fold the bed. And, but you know, you know, also, even with the C check shit, like uh your girl, your oh, I want my girl sitting next to me, does not those rules don't yeah, it's not C check plus one. one. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. If if your girl got up and she wants and the only chair other available is next to another guy, will you figure out a uh, a uh, line of communication between you guys. Yeah. Have you ever had to deal with, I mean, amongst you guys, right? Because, yeah. like, I'm going to try to relate certain things that, like, as a lesbian, I go through that maybe. Like, I'm going to be like, I know dudes, right? This dude's day today. You yeah. know, you're you're in it too. Um, okay. You, have you ever had a thing where, like, you and your boys are always, like, you're always joking, whatever, for example, seat check. Somebody who's mad anal about it. So they're like, no, bro, that's my seat. That's my seat. But all of a sudden, like, there's a girl coming around, and all of a sudden they're acting like the super funny guy, or they're the super, like, oh, no, yeah, it's yours, or whatever. And you're just like, what's up with this fool? Like, what? You know what? You know what? I think I think out of, like, all my friend group, we're all, like, because we're, like, a real. This fool's going to give me a political no, answer. No, no, so no, you, no. Okay, ever in your life, fuck, not just your friend group now. Have you ever encountered that where you got somebody that you're just like, what's going on? Oh yeah, like oh like oh like father the cool guy. Yeah, the super. Yeah, like, yeah, all of a for sudden, sure. You're like, for f- sure. Or 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 if I have a homie that when he's drunk, he's like player. Like yeah, like yeah. Like I'm just like fool. <laughs> you don't have teeth. <laughs> like tell me, everyone don't got teeth. He just be like I'm yeah. Dead. He be like yeah. I got bitches, fool. I got a roster. I'm 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 in the dog Olympics. I'm up right now. I'll be like fool. Shut the fuck up. I'm dead. Yeah, that should be happening. Like, it was, like around, like, I've been around bitches. That, that, that'll that be like, all of a sudden, they're mad, like, philosophical and shit. They're like, you know, well, in life. And it's like, <laughs> shut the fuck. And then, like, the girls will definitely agree, right? Be like, yeah, that's right. And it's like, that's that that's sounds like a right, fucking dude. meme. Like, I mean, it's right. But, like, you read that shit. I've seen that shit on Instagram or on Twitter since fucking 2010. Like, stop fucking acting stupid. You yeah, know? no. One of the things, you know, it's cool. Like, me and all my homies and my homegirls, like, when somebody comes around, like, Okay, oh, there's another rule. If you get mad, you can never come back around again. So, okay, so Christmas, the homie DJ bought his girl That's around. That's wild. <laughs> Wait, DJ, DJ you bought it at Christmas? Fuck your emotions. Never come around again. Um, Banned. For you, you brought, um, oh, you brought it for Maria's baby's birthday. For uh, Bree, when you first got with her. I think it was Christmas. Oh, I forgot what it was, but we told him. I'm like, we told him, send a, send a picture now. So we could get the jokes out the way in the group <gasps> chat. That's <laughs> fucked <laughs> up. Wait, why? Bro, she Wait. got cooked for like an hour straight on the group chat. She was just getting cooked by me, the homie Andy, Beto. Damn. And like just back and forth. And then one time we're on, we're like on a triple date and, and we're bowling. And he's like, hey, babe, you know, definitely you know the homie said you're cross-sighted. <gasps> Bro, I was like, why would you tell her, dog? Like, whoa, fuck it. We'll cross that bridge when she gets there. <laughs> but like Can but she now, see it? Oh, yeah but now she's No it's just When she's drunk She has a really bad lazy eye And I guess that picture That he sent when she was drunk So now whenever she's drunk We'll be like Damn right Like But now she's She's laughs about it now But everybody has gotten it Like Like The homie um, Poet brought a girl around With dirty vans And and after that I she like just, vans should be dirty They're But not. no but she, Hers was like Dirty and suffocating her feet, like oh. the shoe, like so she, not like aesthetic dirty, like it's more like just, it's not like it's not like she like walked near a tire and scraped it. It was like they were like full, like we know she smells. Oh you know what I'm gosh. saying? Who's who else got in the bed? I'm t- Everybody, fool. The hungry Clarissa gets caught fat. Know, I don't even want to know what you guys, what you've ever said about me, Duno. Because today I was telling on my TikTok, I was like, I'm going to, because I was like, oh, my friend Duno. And I was like, well, technically, I mean, he's not my friend, but like, we're going to, I was like, I'm going to ask him today if he wants to be my friend. But then I'm like, yes. why don't you just get it out the way? Look, text me everything you want to say, <laughs> crazy. And then I'll just go, I bet. And then I'll, re- I'll respond. And I'll then we res- could just, and then we just, and that's just, it. They leave it there. there, there. We yeah, just, I think, I think like the homie Andy and his girl, like, she got fat over the years. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I'll be like, hey, Clarissa, you're fat. She'd be like, you're fucking fat too. And then, you know what I'm saying? We just go back and forth. But like, am I tripping that like fat dudes don't care about it as much as like fat girls? Like whenever oh, it's like, because yeah. my tios that, that are like bigger, like whenever they would make fun of me, all I could say was they're fat and they didn't give a, like, they didn't give a fuck. And so they were my worst <laughs> enemy because I'm like, fuck you. Like all I could say, like what else can I say? Like, yeah, no, you don't I have think... a job? Like he knew that. <laughs> like, No, no, no. You know what's crazy? That. Um, I'm very blessed like when it comes to like my homegirls like they're big mm-hmm. like some of the like I have like two big homegirls and they're cool with the fat word yeah. like yeah for you're fucking fat like I'm fat and then <laughs> they be like I still get I still get dick though motherfucker and so I don't and I'm like 
I feel that I still get pussy, so we're in the same. But I think, like, let's say she's, like, there's a bunch of random, like, dudes, and, like, she, they probably think somebody's cute. I'm not out there, like, oh, you fucking fat piece of shit. Right. I'll embarrassing say it maybe people when I'm in front of Yeah, embarrassing people in front of people who you think might be their suitor. That's hater activities, though. But, but also, like, we're, or, like, even the homegirls, if they get boyfriends, oh, a lot of them will stop coming around or don't even probably break up with them sometimes. You guys we're are like, such Mexican deals. No, like, we're like, we're up. like, bro, my friend group, like, I've, I've had to, like, warn like a girl i'm talking to like hey fool you're gonna get in there and 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 it's go time but be ready too you know shoot back like like if one of the homies got a f one arm missing k k do it up i'm fucking dead <laughs> i mean shit okay god yeah. damn i mean he looks a little traumatized i'm not gonna lie you Who, you're DJ? a little traumatized oh yeah. this dude right here has he looks him. a little traumatized he looks like he's on one fucking comeback away from just like just bro, disappearing. Him too. He's a little shy. He just pulled his hat off when no, I no. said that. Beto, I could nah, tell, Beto but yo, are you guys okay? Nah, Beto could cook. DJ, DJ, DJ. Oh, DJ used to have another girlfriend. An oh ex-girlfriend. Oh my god. That one time I was I was like, I made up like this whole story while I like at a at a family, like at a at a party with just all the homies. Where like I was like, yeah, DJ used to have bitches. Like, bro, I'm just lying. He knows I'm lying. I'm a great story. Like, I know how to like antagonize like makeup shit like be funny and dj called me called me in the middle of me bumping on the speaker screaming because he, she kicked that out the car at the freeway because of the jokes i was making on the freeway yes god damn man yeah so the homie the homie has dated right? like a maniac before that's not maniacs yeah no she's crazy but she you're sick i mean maybe she is but like you're saying mad wild ass shit and then, I mean, I don't feel like kicking you off on the freeway is that crazy. You've never kicked nobody off on the freeway. On the freeway? I mean, in Texas, you know how they have those side streets? You know <laughs> Why are you they trying have, to justify okay. it? Like, no, there wasn't lines in between. Okay, you know how in <laughs> Texas, there's like there's the highway? No, because it's like Texas is very specific yeah, yeah. with their little side freeway that they have, yes, which is that, that, that little fucking thing. Yeah. I mean, I've gotten off on that shit and yeah. definitely walked it and was just like, no, nah, I think Guido picked me up. And but I was married to the person, so I was just like, no, get, let me get the fuck out this car right now. No, they fuck it off on the tenth freeway. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, like, like some LA shit. But you, see, gotta, you gotta mention the freeway for us to be like, mm, that's a big freeway. Hold on. Yeah. So then, so God then, damn. So his new girl now that he's been with for a while, he's like sh super happy. She, she like his Doctor Phil. So you know, we like, you know, like, um, Beto don't have a dad. I don't have a dad. DJ don't have a mom. So we go back and forth about that a lot. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. With the with the girl? No, with just each other. Oh, but yeah. you said the girl's the Doctor Phil. Yeah, because he's calm now. He's, he used to be a psychopath. Oh, he used to be a psychopath. Yeah, like he'll scream. He had a really bad anger issues. Really? He would cry when he's mad, but now he got cared by his girlfriend with um. What sign are baby. you? I'm Aquarius. And what sign are you? Gemini. Oh, Jesus! I oh, mean, yeah. I don't know very much about Aquarius. Oh, huh? they're terrible. They're fucking terrible. <laughs> tell us, tell us a breakdown. All right, let, like let's say, like if you were to meet, a, okay, what's your what's the one sign that you definitely wouldn't fuck with? Aquarius. <laughs> <laughs> They're just fucking terrible, evil, manipulating their ass hoes. The first people that ever cheated on me. Do you think Aquarius. there's a difference between signs when it's a female or a male? So, um, people say yeah. People like I when, think so. Like yeah. whenever I talk girls that I'm like, um, that I'm a Pisces, they just somehow get in this mode about how like. I'm a piece of shit, but I'm a loving very deeply, but I might cheat. Yeah. But I'm also my fucking just like Yeah, y'all are buy them a house if I can. And I'm Yeah, like, like y'all are emotional, but it's like you're you're in turmoil. Like you're like, I'm emotional, but exactly what they said is seems like yeah. what exactly what you would do. And um, I'm like, yeah, I sound a lot like YG in his music. Uh, yeah. But me wait. and YG share the same birthday. I mean So he's yeah. like, I love you, bitch, but I'm gonna cheat on you with 30 bitches. And I'm like, I feel it. I get it. It's deep right there, brother. <laughs> But why cheat though? Why why even get in a relationship if you don't really want to? You know what? I I, I learned that about um, a year and a half ago, and, and that's kind of been like my thing. Like, I prefer just not cheating at all. Yeah, like don't even get in the damn relationship. I mean, yeah. I'm going through that right now. I mean, I don't know. You're you're single right now? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm like I'm like I'm kicking it. You're kicking it. Okay. Yeah. Bet me too. So to me, I'm like I'm going through this phase. Okay, because he's single and he's he goes on dates, but like with me, I feel like it's so much harder. Like I feel like my shit just becomes like this whole thing. It's like. Like playing house damn near or whatever and he's like playing because house. i don't have boundaries he told me because i don't have boundaries yeah so it's like i feel like with dudes dudes get to date be single and they're like i'm not ready for a relationship and a girl will respect that because like i'm not ready for a relationship with 
me i feel like it's like i'm not ready for a relationship like no but you're so sweet like you are i'll just wait around and blah blah, blah. And like you promised me a relationship but i'm like no the fuck i didn't like what the hell's going on yeah so do you think i'm fucking up do you think i'm do where am i going wrong okay well when i first came over here you had somebody's dog and i was like <laughs> well, you kind of have the fucking dogs snow. like <laughs> give the, the fucking dog back like you're like oh but it's so cute i'm like i'm like fucking snow like no go give the fucking dog back <laughs> <laughs> and then one time I text you, you're like, yeah, I'm, I'm here for this person. I'm like, Snow, like, what are we doing here? You're like, I'm going to hit you in a little bit. I was like, all right, cool, Snow. Like, you just can't, like, fool. Like, yeah, definitely don't have the dogs here. <laughs> beautiful ranch, by the way. Snow has a beautiful home. I'm like, Snow, you can't just be fucking bringing dogs here because you have room. Just, you know what? You know, this is what you got to do, fool. Because I know you probably, like, once you're a little buzzy, you're like, yeah, babe, I got a ranch with a pool. Let's go do it up right there. No, no okay, she was in the know. hospital. Okay, no, but what I'm saying is like, <laughs> like she was in the hospital and like her dog couldn't stay at her cousin's because her cousins were already sharing a one bed. Well, you shouldn't be like, well, well, for, for you shouldn't be with nobody that stays in her at her cousin's. No, she got an apartment now. I might see the dog here and there. Okay. Back in, well, I wasn't. Yeah. I, mean, I wasn't. For, I, you look, like, stop. Shout out the dog. The reason we haven't dropped our podcast, by the way, is because <laughs> I know he got me drunk. We was drinking 1940. I still wanted to come out. But yeah, he was since that podcast. I don't I know had, why we talked so much shit. Like we just got like big. it was it, we me and Snow went on a rant about like fuck everybody but us. Like it was like <laughs> it was like fuck your mama, your dog, your house, your stairs. We were drinking 1942 like it was nothing, and then we're just like talking, and then he asked me shit, and because he knows me like behind the scenes, yeah. so he's asking specific shit, and then I'm answering like I'm not on camera, and I'm like, oh fuck, I'm like, you know what? Let me just. So I was like, hey, can you send it to me so I can, like, you know, let me go through it. But uh, I'll keep it a buck. I've been on tour my entire fucking year. Nah, like, it's okay. Like, yeah. Shout out congratulations to you, by the way. Thank you. I, I, I got to clap it up because I know you, you fucking, you. fool, you're no, a fucking stop. workhorse, fool. My fucking, like, I went on my whole tour and then I went on um, Santa, Santa Fe Clan's tour fun. and it's just been fucking crazy. But now, you know, I'm home and I do, I'm. I'm the type of person, if I tell you I'm going to do something, I'm going to do something. Yeah, and right. I think it'll even be better because now y'all know about it. So now y'all are going to go check. <laughs> yeah. And when we drop it, y'all are going to be like, oh, this had to be edited. And then just fill in the blanks. Yeah. But the thing is, you know, I mean, I'm, I don't know if you have, you've never been publicly in relationships. No, 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 Okay. No, no, no. Within my fan base, I haven't oh been publicly. What? Interception. Oh, Raiders are playing right now. I'm fucking sorry. Oh, you watching right <laughs> <laughs> Who do you go for the Raiders? Yeah. Oh, okay. You're like, oh, he's a fucking Cowboys fan back there. Fuck that dude too. Oh, I'm no. dead. Oh heck no. Okay. <laughs> okay, but um, yeah. So wait, where the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, are public relationships. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've been in a public relationship, and then I was in two relationships that my fans knew, but the rest of the world didn't really know. Yeah. So when I'm talking to you, and we're talking about exes. Some things I feel like some people will pick up, but some people will think it's about someone else. So I'm yeah, just yeah. like, I was just like, yo, I'm not trying to make nothing messy. Nah, for sure. I'm in a way better place now, thank God, that I'm just like, let me make sure that I don't, you know what I'm saying? Because there be people, yes or no, there be people from your from your past waiting for some shit to fucking pop off for you to be like, say something. I mean, I don't know about yes, you, but I, you know, it's crazy that I um I did a podcast a long time ago with. One of my teachers, shout out to the Roscoe, very great lady, was there for me through a lot. Still have a dope core relationship with her, love her to death. She, I did a podcast with her, and I don't fucking know her. One of my exes texted me like, oh, I knew it. Yeah. I was like, you knew what, bitch? And she was like, I knew you were kicking it with that girl. You thought she was cute. I'm like, she was my fucking classmate. My teacher was cool. Hey, do you think Whoop is pretty? I'm like, bro, she's so pretty. But then my teacher, just her being so comfortable with me, she's like, fool, you used to be flirty. Like... And yeah. I and I still put it out there, but she just had to go on around like fool, like yeah. I'm exactly. like fool. I'm like you know me. I'm just a clown, class clown. Like I mean, they're talking shit. It's never that deep. Yeah, you know what I'm saying no. Yeah, of course. I I feel like that's that's the case with me. Like but yeah, stop taking dogs to your house, fool. I'm dead. But you, but but you know what you gotta do. I feel like there's a thing. Did you drink the, all your titty shot or yeah, fact, I, I got my butt one. Yeah. Well, I guess I should finish mine before we finish. Yeah, but fool, you definitely do. You know what you gotta do. You gotta buy like. A little apartment somewhere and be like nah this is where i live and then let that thing that you brought you're bringing them into their personal life there and then never bring them here the thing is and and i would love that right but it's not as easy for like queer people as it is for straight people right because like for me like at this point it's like people just know and if you don't know like i don't know like i've been at a i've been at a like gay place before right and i think somebody's like about what to like come gay up gay place like we you... well, like a lesbian like a gay like not even lesbian because there's not that many lesbian bars there but oh. gay places like gay yeah, 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 clubs like, or yeah. bars or whatever 
and you know it's like somebody's coming up to me and i'll be like finally like one pretty girl in the whole fucking sorry no offense but like come on let's keep it a buck yeah. um so i'll do one's coming up and i'm just thinking like oh this person's about to talk to me they're like i'm such a big fan i'm like fuck my life you know what i mean like it's like yeah. fuck. like i don't fucking want that you know what i mean like i don't know i just don't fucking do you ever talk about a, a trip to hong kong maybe <laughs> get, get get it out your system over there no yeah maybe maybe i should maybe like i should go i should go kick it in like dr puerto rico mexico just places that people well you're really known in mexico so maybe not mexico mexico oh, like, that's what i'm saying so you might have to do like colombia dr pr Columbia. you gotta pay the price fool. pay the price that sounds crazy though. that's the thing that's what sucks but then at the same time like this comes with it you can meet someone that don't know who the fuck i you are right like i've, I've done it yeah. you can meet someone who don't know who the that, fuck you and are the, that's the best situation though okay but then when they find out oh then it like it's like it's it's subtle it's subtle little ways that they start to just get accustomed to what your life is like you feel me like it's like just little things of just like not necessarily having to worry like like maybe they could be with you know a or they could be with me b right a like you know if they don't got the money or whatever they're just like oh it's okay babe like don't worry about it blah 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 but with me they're like you got it like that's fucked up like what you don't want us to have fun like damn blah, blah. and it's like what the fuck bitch like you would take that fucking chilling in the car with this person but with me all of a sudden i'm cheap because i don't want to fucking take bitch you're gonna take this fucking big mac meal I'm yeah like, yeah yeah you know yeah like off the bat i'm like i'm poor but then that's the like, thing just because i have a lot of views doesn't mean i get money people can make tiktoks about you though later and be like i went on a date with so and so and blah 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 blah. and it's like why do people gotta run into the internet all the fucking time even if they got an nda they don't give a fuck about that shit they're still gonna talk their shit they i'm still. like now nah, i gotta sue you stupid hoe like damn <laughs> Like I don't want to sue you, bro. Like it I was like fucking... it was like the best first day you've ever had. Like 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 you ever had where you were like, oh, this might this might be my little fuck around that she's not too serious, I'm not too serious, and you gotta be kicking it for real. And then I don't know where they just switched up. Like bam, oh never mind. <laughs> I mean, I, look, you gotta know something. Okay, so the U-Haul rule really exists in lesbians. So the, the 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 time that I was like, oh, this is gonna be fucking lit, and then that shit switched up was my last relationship. Mm. Now that's a dog one. The one. The no, one. no, no, my, no. I wasn't in a, my like my last breakup. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. My 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 the dog one. She's actually lit as fuck. Like if I really think about it, like because like she's of her kicking age, it. She's kicking it. Like, yeah, honestly, fire. there was a point where I thought she was using me for dick. Like, sorry. But, like, I thought, like, I was just, she would come <laughs> over, she does her thing, she fucking dips, she doesn't give a fuck. Like, I was like, okay, this is That's fucking fire. great. That's fine. I was like, this. But at some point, I was just like, Whoa, okay, like, this is great. But also, like, are you okay? Like, do you think? And then, you know, then the whole dog in the hospital thing, and I was just like, whoa. But she's, she's fire. It's, it's actually, you know, yeah, shout her, out her, man. Shout her out her and her dog. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> I was like, Snow, what are you doing? She's like, you're like, she's like, I gotta feed a dog. I got a dog too. She's like, nah, it's not mine. I was like, okay, it's not just okay. fucking out here, dog sitting. No, but that was pretty dope. I feel like that was the most mature person because even like when I kind of broke it off, like she was very like, okay, I understand. Like, yeah, tap in whenever you, you need do. that. Bro, like I, it almost <laughs> flipped, it flipped my brain. I was just like. You're like, nice. It, yes, but also my brain's just kind of like, what? And then you just kind of leave and then you kind of like think about it like, what? Is am it, I, uh, where, where you guys? immature? No, nah, no. Nah. Were your guys link ups like always after ten? No, no. We've like it's been. It was cool. You like, 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 like you going to go eat happened. dinner type shit. A lot just happened. I feel like it's just been dramatic because it's been a it's been a year and a half of me knowing I'm not ready for a relationship, mm. and then like I meet this person, and then like we're cool, whatever. But then it's like I'm not, so then I'm doing my shit. But then it's respected because I'm honest. Yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. cheat. I don't. I don't lie. If I'm dating, you know, other people, I'm. T I tell you. So to me, I feel like that's why the. You know, like the doors open because I was like, when I, I didn't do nothing. Yeah, wrong. that's fire, man. Shout out you, know? you and the, shout out you and the the dog owner, man. I'm dead, not the <laughs> dog owner. I mean, I don't want to say. I mean, I don't think I even know her name, but yeah, you her. met her. You fucking met her. on the I podcast. You were talking about on the podcast on your podcast. Mm -hmm. He was so gross. I literally, I'm, I'm deleting that off the podcast. What, what did I say? Because you were like, oh, when I saw you at the at the at the fucking when we went with Santa Fe clan, you said that we were dead. I was dancing all crazy. And oh I'm yeah, like, I, was bro, like, I was like, I was like, Snow's look, over look there getting, I was like, I was like, I was like, Snow's over there getting freaky and shit. And I was like, Ugh. no, he was making these sounds and doing the shit. I'm like, bro, I was, was like, <laughs> I was like, hey, Snow, no. no, I told you, I'm like, bro, Snow. <laughs> Snow be turning it up at the club. I was like, hey, Snow, you got to chill. There's fucking a gang of people over here. <laughs> no, the noises you were making were oh, crazy. But, uh, you were like, acting all caveman. I was like, bro, that is not me at the club Bro, dancing. that was you. You were like, uh, uh. 
No, but <laughs> I'm just, that's just how I cloud. But I'm just like, like, I'm like, I turned around and snow. I was like, yeah. This what I'm saying. Yeah. They know. <laughs> and I was like, because one, okay, where, where the bar we were at, it, it switches up music genres. Like in the instant second. Yeah. <laughs> like you'll go from cumbia to perreo intenso. Yeah. So I turn around one split second and snow's like suavemente. <laughs> and then I turn around again and it's like they're playing asshole by Mike Sherman and Snow's like, yeah. But why? You're just like <laughs> and then and I'm like, oh snow getting freaky up in this motherfucker. Snow so Snow over there just fucking like, you know, toe cold vibes. Like I'm like, oh snow. Bro, you, you bro, you was getting freaky on the dance floor. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I was like, Snow, you gotta turn it down a little bit. We don't got enough space in this motherfucker. I'm fucking but, but, I hate you. But it, but it was funny seeing Pour you. me a fucking shot, bro. It was funny seeing you go from like perro intenso to cumbias to bachata, salsa, and then merengue, and then back to uh, 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 uh. And I was like, First of all, ew on the uh, uh, uh. But also, yes, that's honestly the reason that I go to that spot is because they do that. Yeah, I like that too. That right. Like that place, like the other, like I, right. The other day we popped up on, like Santa Fe Clan and his people were, we're still there, bro. That fool will hop up on that stage at any moment. I like how that <laughs> just, he didn't even say hi to whoever he's with. He just stayed <laughs> up and he's like, <laughs> I'm like, fool, what the it fuck? It don't matter the t- like the size of the stage. Like that's what I like it made me realize that's why, that's why that I'm not amazing. that good of an artist. Yeah, that it made me realize like, bitch, I need to be I need to be a better artist because he will stand up on any stage, any speaker, any mic, and I'm like that's dope. Me, I'm shy. I gotta drink shots of tequila. I'm like the whole crowd can be screaming my name and I'm like shaking backstage. And he's just like, I don't give a fuck. He sings. I'm like inspiring truly fucking inspiring shout out santa fe clan yes lit. you know what shout out him for being able to pull up to a club and just did this every- shit run out I, I was a little bit what about those? oh i don't know I didn't even check. did you even pour yourself one yeah, motherfucker? Well, look, no, no mom it's fucking you no. acting like i'm broke oh there's water by the way oh did i give you one? Oh yeah there you go. yeah nah but yeah shout out that fool for being it for people to be able to sing that people sing that song he's like you know, I'm like, damn, this fool don't know English, and he comes to the United States, and it's fucking Drake down here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, yeah, he's, he's amazing. He's, he's, he's super amazing. dope. He's super, super dope. dope. And um, yeah, that time, that time when we linked up, that time, I mean, shit, I was down near being fucking assistant slash bodyguard because I was trying to keep everybody from texting. Shout out my homies. My homies were there. You know how LA? Well, I'm saying him. before yeah. that, no, when you with you guys, we felt a lot better. Once, yeah, yeah, Because nah, it was nah. you and your homies. But before that, we had been at like restaurants and different oh, yeah, places. Oh yeah, you were telling me. You were telling and, me. And bro, like you see people just start like. You see dudes, right? Like a bunch of dudes in the back just kind of texting and you just kind of like peep and you're like, wait, because they could be texting fans or they could be texting some random yeah, like, like some hey, they about shit, to. Yeah. So I'm just like, this is LA. Like, I'm like, I don't want to be responsible for like, you know? Yeah, yeah. So I'm just like, bro, like I'm telling them, I'm like, yo, stop. Like, you know? And um, then people wanted to fight me and I'm just like, bro, I'm just really saying like, let's keep this man, you know, alive and healthy. But nah, great fucking it's dude. LA, man. You yeah, know? big heart. He's, he's dope. He's dope. But that's the thing. And it's hey, like, you know, it's dope seeing your guys' relationship. Like the yeah. way you guys kick it in clown, I'm like, I'm like, that's dope. Like, I like seeing genuine shit behind the scenes. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Like I caught snow the other day. She had you just waking up, but my mom, <laughs> my cousins from Mexico are like, oh, <laughs> the your hijo made it. He's with snow and and Santa Fe. And then I'm like, mom, you want to color? My mom, it doesn't want to ever fucking cook. I caught snow one time. She's like, tiene que le llevo pambazo. Some of the left Fuck it. Yeah, that's and I'm like, like, lady. Snow's on a diet. Yeah, but I mean, I'll yeah. pull up. I've never had that. Man, you got to pull up and just come eat at my mom's kitchen. Straight up. Yeah. I'm going. It's, I got. It's, I finally it's... got a car again. My car was in the shop. What happened to your car? My car was in the shop for like mad long, and then finally they totaled it out, so then finally they sent me the checks, and then finally I bought another fucking car, because I was just like, fuck. But I was on tour the whole time, so for me, it was like, okay. Yeah, yeah. But then I was home for like two weeks, and I was like, bro, I can't live like this. So then I, you know, so I feel I feel good with having a vehicle now. Yeah, facts. Except for, you know, it's wrapped. Up. For some reason, I decided to wrap it the most fucking wild color, and now I was it's in L.A., and I was like, bro, I'm like, what am I you doing? I'm, I'm downtown, and I'm just like, you know, I'm about to park, and then I'm like, and then I hear the little alarms, you know, when there's like, warning, blah, blah, blah. The police has been called with another car, and I'm like, oh, they're definitely hopping in my car. I'm like, fuck, I'm going to get bipped for sure. Don't so now I got bad. a valet. Damn, bro, it, when, when I went to the Bay, I was so scared to get bipped because I was in a rental. <laughs> Hopefully they don't pip the insurance is not gonna cover this shit like straight up. That's how I feel with my fucking car. And I'm like, yeah, and of course, yeah. Look, love the purple car. Yeah, my ass. Well, because yeah, the person you who got a fucking it, purple car, dog. It's the color of those boxes, bro. Who allowed you to do that? My stupid ass. Were and you guys like? Were you guys like? Car. Don't fucking do it. I don't know. I mean, 
Nah. He's like, he's like, I don't <laughs> care. I only care about the Raiders. <laughs> 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 no, yeah. It's, I mean, it's dope. It's fire. And if you go to Hollywood and you valet it, you good. Like, we went yeah. to, what, Eladio the other day. And fucking, you know, we was parked right there in the front. Like, it's all good. The problem is when you're, you know, if I'm trying to be low key, I got to have a low key car. So, mm. you know, I got to have like a little Jeep from like, you know, like oh, like 15 or something. And just, just a, the, the. Yeah, for just tint everything out. Yeah. Just tint it out, get some low key shit. And that's your little fucking fuck around cart, your little out the way. You can maybe go yeah. tagging in it. Tagging. This fool wants to go tagging. I'm like, the last time I went tagging, I think I was like 15. I had just bought some brand new Cortezes and we had to like go under some bridge and there was like um, mud. And literally I was so, I was about to cry because like at the time, you know, we were broke as fuck. So like I couldn't buy it. Like, like you know, like yeah, that's my yeah, brand yeah, new. Sure. So I'm like about to cry over my shoes because I used to like really value my shoes. Well, I always do. And then the fucking guy fucking goes, don't worry, I'll fucking carry you. And he fucking carried me. By the way, these are the like most girl stories I've ever fucking had because literally they did. They carried me around while they fucking um, tagged, but they probably thought I was straight. <laughs> so anyway, sorry. <laughs> I was going to ask you, do guys still hit at you? Yeah. That was some uh, mamacita, and you're like, I'm gay, fool. Yeah. But they go like, why are you lying? And then you got to go like, where's your girlfriend? I'll take her right now type shit. Like, no, yeah, they, they do. But, but and, and you know what's crazy is like people like me, like I'm not rude because people like me. So you'll flirt back? No, no, no. I, I'll say like I'm not interested, but I'm, I can't be rude because then they'll want to fight me. Girls like femmes, like the girls I date, they get hit on and the dudes are being like mad at it. And like they can be rude and the dudes will still be like, oh, you you missing. Blah, 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 blah. But if I'm rude, they'll be like, oh, you think you're a fucking man? And then they try, oh, try to fight you and you'll be like, what the fuck? Literally, I've been pumping gas before and just been like shaking or like I've been walking before and then they would be like, oh, you think you got a fuck? And it's like, what the f This took a turn. Like you just hit on me <laughs> five seconds ago and now you want to fight me like a man yeah and i'm just like what the fuck like yeah so for me i, I just try to oh thank you bro like no it's cool man i'm fucking gay like you know there's a <laughs> fucking bitch right here but whatever um has you know, um do you have a lot of gay friends or no or a few i have you <laughs> uh <laughs> count your gay friends do, do we have gay homies uh, Bedics? Yeah, we got a couple gay homies. You guys got some undercover gay homies? Come on, keep it up. Yeah, I think on, I think I think we are. I think I think we got one homie that's undercover and yeah, they so but we told the fool. We we tell him all the time. Hey fool, if you're gay, we're gonna be here for you, Perrito. We love you to death. We're you can be the gay one. We're gonna care for quick. you. You just just know where we we always got you, like fool, like you're still family. I'm not fucking gay fool. I'm like, oh, I don't know, wobbler, wobbler. Yeah. But we told that fool like but like a lot of the homegirls have gay homies that come around us. Cool ass fools, yeah. Yeah. So I don't know. But like I don't, have, I don't have a lot of lesbian homegirls though. Yeah. But but gay fools, I definitely know a couple of like a couple of homegirls. But in high school we definitely kicked through a couple of gay homies. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's it's Cause I think to me, like that whole narrative where you're like, I'm a man and I'm like, bro, that shit out the way. Like let people live their life. Life's pretty simple. You let them live life. You live your life, bada bing, bada boom. You move along. Yeah, yeah, have good experiences with good friends, and that's about it. Like, um, but we definitely got the undercover homie. Damn. Yeah. So, so when the day comes, how about it? I've always wondered though, because I mean, I have a lot of like, I have a, my more of like my more Mexican. I'm not only Mexican, by the way. There's a lot of everywhere, but in my experience, because I am Mexican and yes. I've been around. Um, not been around. Well, I've been around I've Mexican been around. friends. <laughs> Hold on, chill. Um, there be those dudes, you know, that are just like, you know, they'd be like, oh, and then they like grab each other's dick and you're just like, what what, what at 9 p.m. is making you like grab another man's? Like, you know, and you guys are joking and tickling and, and laughing and I'm just like, <laughs> what's happening? Like, this is crazy. Not but those are the same dudes that'll be like, you know, talk, talking to girls like, oh, she ain't shit. But it's like, bro, you just grabbed your homeboy's dick at 9 p.m. <laughs> like, this is insane right now, you know? But nah, nah, I whoa. notice it. But I don't but know if people now we'll do. definitely like nut check the fuck out of each other, like just nut check, bam, or just some wild shit like that. Oh, yeah. Just but not check. like gra what does nut check? What are you guys checking? Like prostate cancer? No, type? no, like no, like like fucking you like tap the balls, and it hurts very bad. Oh, I don't know. What you, you ever play that? You ever nah, nut check each really. other? Well, I guess in high school, kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, and I wasn't that. But like, what's the what were y'all doing? Supposed to do? Oh no! It like, just hurts just really move? bad. Like, it's just, it just like your reflexes, right? Yeah, like it just hurts. Like it, that shit goes to your stomach. What? It's kind of like you guys part. getting punched in the boob. Ow! Why would a girl, if a girl just walked up to me and goes boob check and just punches me, I'll no. punch her in the fucking face. I'll be like, "What no, the fuck are think, you doing?" But I think with guy, I think it's like a guy thing, like nut check, bow. It's not like you're grabbing the nuts and squeezing them. It's like a 
like a backhand thing, like a pow. Oh, maybe with nut check it, for guys is maybe like kind of how like straight girls will make out with their best friend, but they're not gay. N That's like no, homosexuality no, no. check. <laughs> <laughs> No, like no. maybe we're maybe no like if you nut check your homeboy and y'all lock eyes like you're like ooh, you know but if like no yeah like on the chat's like i never played that but i don't know i'm gay <laughs> okay first of all we're not grabbing each other's dicks we're just it's just a quick bam like a like a backhand to the to the to the uh, to the balls you know what's crazy i guess we'll never know like between men and women we'll never know how much like a like kick to the balls hurts versus like a, like a giving birth to... like all yeah, these yeah, things yeah, like we'll, we'll never like actually know what because i I've, we've seen it in movies right a guy gets kicked in the fucking area and then he's just like oh he's hunched over and like on the floor and shit and it's just like i mean yeah like a boob punch would hurt but i don't i don't know and girls don't do that i'm trying to think of what the what the Nut check for girls is. I mean, I it's kind of like. A, nah, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> you know, I, I'm trying to think like slap the balls is funny. <laughs> slap of the balls. No, she said slap of the balls. Slap of the balls. I can't believe you never like, bro. Yeah, like it's like it's like a, I feel like it's like a boy thing. Like you know, like locker room said, like like we're slapping the shit out of each other. And it's just like bow, and he just fucking run away because it hurts really bad. Well, that's like locker room stuff, right? Yeah, but we we'll just do it like if we're being cool, like we're like if we're being assholes to each other, then then we'll, then we'll start, you know, like. Just... Do you guys do you guys ever hug? Me and my homies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when we're drunk. And you guys be like, oh, dude, when we were at the Eladio concert, I saw three guys hugged to the point where it's like, and then they like one of them was really swaying, so I was like, maybe two of them are just holding him up, yeah. and I was just like really just paying attention to this, like you know, like sometimes I people watch, so I just be watching this, yeah. like I'm watching, you know humanity and um they would get real close on some lyrics like they would be all up in his ear and i'm just like yo th these are homeboys i'm assuming but they <laughs> yeah. also could be like you know experiencing sexuality like maybe seeing how close they can get with a man or maybe they just <laughs> really love each other and they're just like yo our homeboys really going through it like we're trying to but i'm talking about like their mouth would be like pretty <laughs> close vicinity like while there's a love song going but so I'm like, okay, like this is totally cool. I'm just also watching. I've never I don't seen think, this in the I wild. Think, I, I, yeah, if I don't think I've ever grabbed any of the homies and was like, just sang fucking Eladio or Bad Bunny to their ear. But I've definitely <laughs> grabbed one of the homies and like, and like we'll sing. Um, fuck it, we have a song in our in our friend group called um, Semarita by um by Junior Ache. And it goes like, Junto a mi carnal, no es de sangre, pero. Oh, so, I've heard that, yeah. So, yeah. so we play that shit, and then we just get all emotional, like, I'm always going to be here for you, perro. Or, like, we have a song, Um, one of our songs, too, is Solar Eclipse by NBA Youngboy. And oh. we'll just sing it with all the homies, all the homegirls. But getting, like, that close to, like, El Audio is a little crazy. Yeah. Well, I mean, El Audio had some trap. But, yeah, he, it was, it was, I believe those guys were just going through it. And. You know, that's literally the only, like, I like to go out. Well, I was the sober one that day I was driving, but I was just watching, and I'm like, mm, interesting, like, to watch people just, whatever the fuck their dynamic is, you know, yeah. maybe they're figuring it out, maybe not. Um, It's, you know, it, it's it's up to whoever the fuck. Whatever your friendship is, there's people who hug a lot more than, than, than others. Um, that fool Beto likes to hug us when he's drunk. I love you, fool. Oh. I love you. And I'm like, fool, shut the fuck up. Like there is a certain limit where people is like they take it too far because I have some homegirls too who like they'll start repeating the same shit over yeah. and over and you're just oh, like all right bro shut the fuck up oh yeah it's fucking terrible that I'll, night that we that when we went out to fucking what was it ballet or whatever fucking yeah. and we saw each other from the cross I was like snow we, we before we did like the Spider Man like this yeah, <laughs> yeah. one of my homegirls fucking crashed into a tree while she was walking or whatever the fuck nice. she did I was like god damn I was like man bro like, come nice. on no it was because we got there at one twenty. Yes. The club yes. closes at two. We had forty minutes to show up, get through fucking whatever, get a bottle, get all that shit. You know, I went over there, linked up with you, came back. We got yeah. lit as fuck. There's bitches in the fucking section. We had forty minutes to do this entire fucking thing, and uh, we succeeded because I was lit as fuck. And then we left. First time I go to this one random spot. I don't want to say too much, but random spot, after party spot. They got hookahs and shit like that. And it was just like that's cool. But I would like to suggest something to management. Like it's a. I don't know. The spot had to be like maybe the size of this building, which was there's it, another room. How far was it from where we were at? It was pretty and, close. And, and I might be. It was pretty close. If you, if you show me the address, maybe if you still have Yeah, you've probably been there. Yeah, you showed like, show like, me and I'll be like, oh shit, yeah. yeah. Ghetto. <laughs> Smoke, yes. Fuck. Like I literally, like, okay, so for me, I can't do studio sessions where people start smoking too much weed. Like, I was going to tell boxes. you, like, especially since you like work, uh, like, with, like, you know, rappers that smoke a yeah. lot. 
I've always thought about like, do you fucking just check out? If it gets too smoky, if I can't breathe like real oxygen, like I, I, I'm i like, bro, I gotta go. Like I can't do this shit. And it's not being, you know, sometimes people think I'm being bougie or something, but I'm like, no, literally. Like my fucking, I'll get sick. My throat will yeah, start hurting. Much. Like tomorrow I'm I'm shot. I'm just like, I just don't want to do it. I could smoke here and there, but fuck, why do you want to like hot box and you're just like crazy? It's wild. But anyway, yeah, that spot. We go. The people who invited us, right, from whatever the little circle was. Yeah. They don't even got the plug. Their people don't even got the plug. I show up and obviously my fucking, you know, they recognize, the person recognized me. Then they give us a table. Don't you hate whenever somebody goes, see, I told you I got you. And then they take all that credit and you're just like, God, damn, like, whatever. You're sitting there. I'm chilling. And then the fight breaks out. As the moment a fight broke out after I had my little sip of liquor, I was like, I got up. I was like, I'm leaving. This is crazy. I'm, damn. I'm in no, I'm telling you, I finally sit down, have a drink. You went solo or you went Santa? No, it was it was it was us. It was my crew. Um, yeah, yeah I think they went to fucking Long Beach or something. They went somewhere far, and I was like, bro, I'm cool. Like five minutes away from here, and then I'm leaving. Like Eladio too. Everybody, like when we were at that concert, everybody's like, oh, let's go back. You know, do this or whatever. I'm like driving, and then I'm like, I see the exit towards my house. I'm like, I'm going. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'd be like, I'd be I'd be over shit too though. Yeah, Wait, like in the moment you're like, yeah, let's do this, let's do that, and then you're like. Like the moment you smell the hot dogs outside and you just fucking, you know, you... Oh, I'm a sleeper, fool. You know, you could just fucking rub your feet together and go to bed. Like, that yeah. shit feels good. We enjoyed ourselves. I think we also need to know when to just... It's okay to call it a night early. Like, have a good time. Have yeah. some drinks. I'll be, I'll be like, it's me, me time. Like, I'll be... I like... I have a rule, especially because I'll be going out a lot to drink and shit. Like, I have a rule. Like, fool, I'm kicking it. Yeah. That's good. I need to kick it with you more often. We need to have yeah. the the Mimi Times type people that are just like, you know yeah, what? Yeah, food pull up. Food Th this circle right five. here is dipping. Oh, yeah, not the way. These yeah. could party on a Tuesday night. Yeah. I'm, I'm not doing nothing after 10 p.m. on a Tuesday night. Yeah. I'll be over it. I'm like, fuck you, food. I'm, I'm not hanging out with you, food. Yeah, especially because there's so many things that are like brand related or artist related, related that we like show up and we do our little, you know, it's our networking. That's our job. We got to show up or whatever. Yeah. But it's like, damn, bro, you want to go do an after party and fucking 30 minutes away from here. And I don't even know what that's going to look like. I'm good, bro. Like, yeah, nah, nah. If it's I'm too tired. far, like, I'll do it still. But like. It's the way. Uh, but I, uh, but I, I want to do it, but I got to do it still. But like, but, I don't want to do but it. I like, I'll be a little more cautious. Like, like, oh, we gotta be deep with all the homies and you fools drive, take my car. Like, don't let me act stupid. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But they've done some asshole shit before my homies. Fucking pieces of shit. One time I knocked out and they put me in the back seat and put a bunch of clothes over me, <laughs> and then just left me back there while I was asleep. While they were in a like an after hours party, what a fucking assholes, huh? I mean, a that's fair. Like they get the clothes. Yeah, shout out. At fucking, least for them um, to put clothes over you meant they cared. They're like, we're not just gonna leave him out here like a mark. We're but I'm like, but I'm like, you fucking assholes. Man. You, your your windows aren't tinted. You pieces of shit. Well, that's probably why they didn't. That's I know. But what if I would have fucking suffocated in the clothes? You all right? They didn't put a bag on you. Nah, but still, like in Vegas, you did that to me, huh? A when, bag? No, they didn't put a fucking bag, but. They left me like at a random parking lot of a fucking hotel room in Vegas. Yes, yes. It was in the parking lot, and we were still going walking the strip, but this fool was already drunk and knocked out. So they just left me in the back seat. I'm like, fool, I have my chain on, and these fool, I'm like, well, somebody could have broke the fucking window, just grabbed the chain and took off. I mean, yeah. I mean, in their defense, I mean, damn, what do they do? Call it a night? Can't yes. You? The strip was wack. The strip was wack in Vegas. Overrated. Which one? The um, the main one or, or like, the main one overrated? Main one? Yeah, old like, Vegas is still cool. Old Vegas is still cool, and I think it's crazy because I've seen comments because I be going to old Vegas or whatever. People are like, oh, I've seen her in old Vegas acting all regular. Yeah, bitch, like the fuck. I'm the regular ass person. I'm trying to have a good old time. Old Vegas and, is lit. Yeah, and old Vegas is way more fun because it's like I'm gonna see a bunch of I'm gonna see a crackhead. I'm gonna see a fucking da random dancer. I'm a gonna see butona. man. Ran yeah, exactly. Like it's like er I can see everything, and I can have a cheap drink and just chill. I'm a, yeah, facts. Versus like yeah, okay, I'm gonna go to fucking one of these Hakkasan and all that shit. Okay, cool. But like even if you get a table, like I've been in like. Like fancy Vegas and we get a table and we're chilling and now we sorry and now I'm chilling and I'm sitting there like staring at other people that can't even fucking dance they're just like and I'm like oh my god <laughs> bro fuck. I'm a fucking like I hate I hate like bougie shit that's so boring I, I'm, I'm a fan of bougie shit that's fun yeah like I love dude there's this bar 
that me and my homies love going to, and it's fucking the lit. It's hot as a sauna, but it's lit. Yeah. And I'm like, bro, I have a great fucking time here. Yeah. I get a fucking whatever type of drink. I get you a, mean like Lazita? La Sala Lazita. La Sita is too much. I feel like it's fucking too much. Yeah, but on, but, on a random day, if you cool. take somebody, the cool thing about La Sita is it's always going. So it's like, yeah, yeah, on yeah. a random day, if you're kicking it with somebody, let's say you want, like, with a chick or whatever, and you just still want to listen to music and drink, but you don't want to, like, you, you might pop up in La Sita and something's happening. Sala La Sita. I fuck. You know what? Or Las Perlas. You been to Las Perlas? You know what? When I went to Las Perlas on a fucking random, like either Monday or Tuesday night, they had a group of fucking that was playing rock and español, mm -hmm. but like a jazz version or some shit like that. Mm -hmm. We met some two baddies there that night. I didn't go home till like seven in the morning. I fucked one of the one of the baddies, but it was like a random night. Like it's empty. There's like mm -hmm. we were fucking buying like it's always the house high, drink, and I was like, this is cool. Not sponsored, but I support those two places. I, and you and bro. I mean, and, and yeah, they're fucking uh, like, Bedex, where do we go? Oh, the Normandy bar is cool. Mm -hmm. we, there's some little bars like it's, it's like a Broadway speakeasy. Bar. Broadway bar is cool. Like, but we just go fucking just go have a drink and it's normal. They play great fucking music. Yeah. And I'm like, this shit is a vibe. Like we went somewhere last time and they had karaoke. It was lit. Yeah. I'm like, I bro, I haven't had, I'm like, bro, I haven't had this much fun in a while. Cause you know, when you go to the booth, like, like I said, it's fun. Like, yeah, all the baddest bitches are going to be there. But like, like sometimes I don't want to fucking go get a bottle or just be in a section just being all cool and posing for the pictures like nah I wanna that's some cool, cool yeah. yeah and you know show all my moves and like we gotta remember like as Mexican people like we wanna do the, the things that we grew up doing you know what I mean like if we wanna dance to some fucking cumbia you're not gonna fucking do that shit at a fucking rooftop next to fucking you know Haley and Ashley and shit like I mean <laughs> but if you take Haley and Ashley to the spot they're gonna be like oh my god I had a crazy amazing time they're bro, gonna think they're in fucking Ciudad de Mexico bro like they're facts. gonna be like oh my god this was so exotic so you're like bro take them over there they have a fucking blast like trust me that shit is crazy i mean not that i'm in the, to Haley and ashley <laughs> <laughs> well you have to clarify that hey, do you like white girls <laughs> that's what i meant oh that's what Sorry. you meant oh. <laughs> <laughs> i'm like i'm like you're not into the blondes <laughs> no i mean you know I, i'm sure there's some there's there's a few little spicy like white girls yeah. I've, I've met some that are just like hey you snow, know who? let me be your snow you know who um what's her fucking name god damn okay come back to the conversation because i need to fucking think of her okay Tay. Tay Money. I fucking love Tay Money. Tay Money. I love Tay Money and her little lisp. I love that bitch. Yo. We, I we love lisp, that bitch. We love, <laughs> we, we, we lisp sisters. But no, I, I fucking love Tay Money. I feel like she she's the shit. Um, like, a, like a, I need me, the, maybe I'll put that in a bar. Like, if I'm going to get a white girl, I'm going to get me a white girl like Tay Money. That's fine. Like, that, that's, you know? that, yeah, for the dope white girl. I'm more like a fucking <laughs> Mila Kunis vibes. Well, Mila Kunis isn't white, though. She's not. What is she? She's she speaks. Like, have you ever seen her speak her, her language? Like, I love that shit. What she, is that, Russian? She, she speaks. Oh, she's not white? Nah. Fool, to all of us, to all of us, they're white, fool. Bro. Ukrainian. Get, Ukrainian. Oh, even better. She's an exotic bitch. Bro. But she don't her, shower, fool. Put her up on this thing, speaking her language, bro. That bitch uh, is hot. But yeah, she don't shower. What's yeah, up with that? I don't know. That's I'm weird. White people shit. A lot of people say, you know, but you know, you know what? Five no years, offense to white people, yeah, but at the same out, time, white people. there's just a difference in cultures. Yeah. And you know, it is what it is. Have you been to that? Um, I'm, maybe I just got to go with two. But there's like this bar I saw on TikTok that's like the aesthetic is all Ciudad de Mexico. Which one? Uh, I don't hey, know. Hey, yeah, yo, pull up. What? You guys hear the alarm? What alarm? Yeah, uh, I hear it. I hear it, it now. What I hear it, it now. What is that? Well, Wait, is it in the house? Where is it? Oh, it's coming from the side of the boiler from this house. Fuck. Better Fuck. Score. Hold on. From That's this cool. house or the my house? This house? Oh, like this house? Oh, so go look. I did, but I don't know if you guys are burning. So that sound is coming from over there? If we were burning. He didn't know if we were I burning didn't. in here. <laughs> All about to say, holy huh? fuck. They look so worried. They're like, we're going to explode. Wait. Did it stop? No. Wait, but it's coming from this boiler? No, from right here. Like where the gym is and everything. Okay. So Did from you the get gym? closer to it? Is it like yeah, good? Yeah, I touched it and stuff. Oh, okay. So I want to come. So but oh, yeah, wait, but it's not coming from my house. No. No, it's coming the from gym. right here. Where the where this that boiler. door is that yeah. you always... And you touched it? Yeah, I touched it. But, but there's... I've never heard that. What is that sound? Alarm. Yeah, I don't know what kind of... What kind of alarm? Smoke alarm? Can we? Yeah, just go check it out. That's weird. 
Sorry. No, that's cool. There's I like that. So many things in the fucking ranch that is like there's so many buildings that you'd be like, there's seven buildings on the fucking ranch. So is, you never is, know. Is there seven? There is seven. I was counting them when we got here. By the way, my homies love your ranch. They thought it was beautiful. Thank you. So they we have like, the I, I still never took you to the merch. No. Okay, but, so yeah. Can we see your goats after? Yeah. I mean, they're in the house now, you know, what to, do you hide, mean? to run away from the coyotes. But if oh, I take you to we're my, just talking about that with your brother. So check this shit out. If you if you go to my studio, there's baby chickens getting ready to meet the new chicken. I mean, the big chickens. So they're they're they were baby. They, I bought them like this. They're like this now. They're big ass chickens. So they're getting ready to go over there. So everybody that I've had in the studio, mind you, there's people with like. 20 million followers showing up to my studio and literally just they're like chickens, chickens and it smells like chicken shit and I'm just like I'm sorry this is where I keep the chickens right now like I don't know what else to do they're like yeah it's cool you have a farm like that's fucking understandable yeah, I think I'm like yeah is, is a fucking horse the next step well we have a 11 horse stall and like two years ago I put permits in to like what I'm really building is a media warehouse where oh, the horse right there, stall right there, right yeah. There, yeah, so that fire. whole thing is gonna be a big thing and it's gonna Ito's getting a cheers, two bedroom bro. apartment cheers We're like, there's an alarm, but if it goes down, fuck it. Oh, at, least we, at least we're buzzing it. Look, the way my fire insurance is set up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I mean. Yeah, like, <laughs> your, cousin, your cousin walked in. He's like a boiler. They both turned around like a boiler. Right. We're like, <laughs> a lot of boilers in this fucking place. A fire. No, but. Oh, look. look oh, this is a lacuna. Right. Okay. Yeah, see, this makes me, this made her more sexy. Right. She said, if you don't know much of him yet. <laughs> it sounds like, it, it sounds, sounds like dope. she's talking to fucking Voldemort in Harry Potter. Uh, I see my thing. No, it's, it did make her, like, I used to always have a crush on her. She's so sexy to me. I heard her, you know, her speak like that, and I was like, hey, yo, that's fucking fire. You know, not until recently it got a little fucking, you know, questionable, but it's it's, it's all good, you know? Yeah, Go nah, ahead, girl, do your thing. Yeah, Sara Melacuna is just, fire. Te, fool. I can't take you to the family, carne asada. Damn, you had chickies mm -hmm. up here? Yeah, oh that's my, my baby right there. Oh, love you love Cheeky? I love Cheeky. Oh yeah, I remember you were trying to we was you were trying to like compete with me for her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. Yeah. I think you won though. No, <laughs> her fiance did. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're not even married yet. You go back, girl. <laughs> Turn around. We here. <laughs> you got the those. You look those those fucking yeah. those those idiots. Un camino, right? Yeah, yeah. It's just us. Bro, yeah, yeah. Cheeky, yeah, Cheeky's amazing. I love her. No, no, yeah. It's 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 all fun and games, but um, Whoa, yeah, she was you? here. No, no, I mean, you're serious over here, homie. Oh, no, I'm no, I'm saying it's all fun and games that I'm saying that. Like, respect to your engagement. Oh, respect yeah, shout to her out engagement. Love. Shouts out love. We love love. And remember, don't let a boyfriend stop you from finding a husband, huh? <laughs> Just like that. Nah. Nah, you know what's we funny? love um, that. Yeah, shout out her. She looks happy. Good for her. Uh, That's good, good for her. Man. Good for yeah, her. Yeah, I still lit. love you, though. It's like I said, if it don't work out, just just pull up real quick. You feel me? We'll get some tacos. You know what I'm saying? She accepted a date on La Platica. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, because I went on a rant. You feel me? It's because like I was I was breaking down the things. I was like, okay, if I either get with Becky G or like, you feel me? Like, um, Cheekies, mm -hmm. like who would it be more cooler to pull up to the carne asada with? What do you think? Hypothetically speaking. That's that's a wild. Like, that's not, that, no, like, that's just, no, for me, that's a wild thing because like you're just gonna snow the product says this or that. So I can't. I'm not gonna lie. They, they both the, have their thing. You feel okay, me? Okay, bro. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I did. Just, uh, I did personally text Becky G when she went through her breakup. But ah! I was practicing soccer. <laughs> yes, no. <laughs> and you know what? You know what? I, I was like, hey, yo, I want the Rams practicing yeah. some soccer, baby girl. No, I'm you joking. Know what? No, I'm, it's a look. It's all fun and games, bro. Don't make me be a creepo. No, the internet not. loves to make me seem like I'm a douchebag. You know what? See, but like, I'll be the douchebag for you, Becky G, baby girl. Uh, okay, <laughs> what, what, can we get the one angle? Just me, <laughs> baby girl. I'm gonna pour some tequila. Just know I called out the. Hey, I said it too. I was like, hey, this fool's gonna cheat and fumble the bag. That's exactly what he did. I have. I called there before he did it. That's just. Look, and, and, I have no. And you, you know what? When I saw I her, I broke it down. I was oh a bitch. I was like, I didn't even know what to say. She walked by me, and I was like, ah, oh, she's beautiful. No, she is very beautiful. Very beautiful. She's very beautiful. And and honestly, bro, <laughs> shut up because you're wrapping me up in some shit. Look, I, oh. first of all, I do not co-sign anything he just fucking said. I said they're both One. beautiful. Two. 
Anything and if two, I don't know what the fuck is going on between Becky G and her ex or whatever the fuck. Y'all deserve all the privacy and respect that you fucking deserve. She is very fucking beautiful, and anybody very that would beautiful. ever fumble Becky G is a fucking idiot. But I agree. You know, everybody's human. I don't fucking know what to say, so I'm gonna take this shot right now because <laughs> when in doubt, drink it out. Here we go. Chickies, I love you, baby. Come home when you're ready. <laughs> I'm talking shit. We from the ghetto. That's how we talk like. But yeah, no, Becky, Becky G's amazing. Becky G, Cheeky, like you gotta, you gotta, you feel me? You gotta love him to death. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Yeah. Are you calling Cheeky's right now? No, I'm gonna take a picture of me and you, and I'm gonna send it. Oh yeah, tell I love her. Ready? <laughs> Your face, you're Ooh. so dumb. I'm telling you, I had this conversation, and you know, you know, it's cool that she laughed about it because she went on like after me. And she's like, bro, everybody was sending me the clip how Duno was just going around about taking me on a date. I'm like, bro, you got to manifest certain things, you know what I'm saying? I'm dead. You're so... So I put love with cheese to the kind of saw that is up. My brownie points are up with my family. No, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Who's like... She's who's... who. She's actually who helped me book the banda that I have for my quinta I never had the last yeah, show. Yeah. Like, I literally hit her up and I'm like, I know you got a fucking banda. <laughs> I know you got a my speed dial for show. Yeah. No, because she She has an like, amazing voice. Because she literally hit me up and she said um, that she got to come back to the pod, which to me, look, I'm going to keep it a bug. This pod is my baby. You know why? Because it's just me and my brother... We made this in my house. Like this yeah, used to this be in my a, living room. Fire set up. For me to have this to me is like it's it's like I didn't even think very much of it. I made it up in the pot in the um in quarantine because I yeah. wasn't gonna have tour. So yeah. I was like, okay, here's a way to like stay connected with my fan base, whatever. So for now, for to have somebody as famous as like Cheeky's, like, you know, Grammys and shit, it'd be like, Oh, I'm coming back. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, you know, or like yeah, people who agree to my yeah. shit, like Kenya came through, like I'm like, dude, like that's crazy, and I don't even know where the fuck we could take it. So, you know, you know what it's like. You, you, yeah. you went from like you was joking on the internet to like you on podcast, you on radio, you on this, mm. you on that. Like, you know what it's like to grow yeah, and facts. be like, yeah, yo, like. And you want to know what's the funniest shit I've seen in a while? What? When um, it was you and who for who was backstage with us also at the at your your spot in Anaheim. Chiquis, um, comadre. Com is it comadre? Comadre. When you were like, you ever play sports? <laughs> like, He's like, and I'm gay. And that <laughs> shit was fool. That shit was funny as fuck. Cause like, even they caught you guys like, doesn't mean you can't play sports. But you were yeah. like, you like you ever play sports? No, I'm, I'm gay. gay. Yeah. That oh, shit had me crying. No, bro, straight up. If hey, you were in the choir, fool. Yeah, you know it disconnected. Just so you know, um, the chat did. Um, but yeah, I was in the choir. I That's was uh, crazy, fool. Yeah. Now you're all a demon, though. I'm not a demon. Fool, you drink, like. So does the priest. I was gonna say a super dark humor joke. Let's just move on from this. No, um, we can do whatever. Like, look, and I got the, like I grew up Catholic, like straight up. Are, are you not? Are you not any? Really, I mean, I don't want you to get all deep in it, but like, no. Are you just um, like you're cool? I pray every single day a Fire. lot. I fucking I do, you know I pray to sleep. I pray when I wake up. I'm grateful. I'm persino when I get on the freeway. Like a Amazing. lot of things like still you know are very traditional. Tengo la Virgen de Guadalupe aquí. Fui al you know Castillo de Chapultepec. Like I fucking went to the fucking uh, was it not the Castillo de Chapultepec the fucking um, Tepeyac. Like yeah. I do the things that are very you know like on Catholic brand based. for us. But at the same time. You know, I also know that religion and like men making things have has usually ruined it. It's not just men. I'm just saying, yeah, like yeah. man yeah, yeah, making yeah. things has usually ruined it for me. A connection with God is very important to me. I do believe in the universe and all these things, but at the end of the day, like I believe that there is a God, and that's my main thing. I have a conversation with God every single day. That's my thing. Yeah. Will I go to Catholic church? Yes. Si alguien me invita and they're like, yo, let's go to church. Like, no le, no le temo, you know? Like, yeah, I'll yeah. go. Like, me persino. Well, yeah, like, yeah, but, I have the respect. But it just never gets any super deeper to where, like, you got to question certain shit. I think there's some hypocrisy within yeah, the fucking... Sure. You know, I think there's hypocrisy within it. And I think we, we got raised in a, in a way that hit it bro like there's there's a lot of people who's like grandpa was a creepo whose uncles was a creepo and everybody rather hide it because they don't want to like ruin the family or whatever the fuck or the priest was being weird like they never protected the children as much as they protected the identity of like you know catholicism yeah, or yeah. family or whatever there's so some wild me, shit behind all that shit you know so sometimes i'm just like bro i don't i don't i don't fuck with that but other than that, it's like, yo, like, 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 you know, God, La Virgen, you know, all that. Like, they didn't do nothing to me. The the people behind all this shit did. So I yeah. just blame people. Yeah, I just be, I be like, I don't try to get too deep because I know, like, I, I'm just not educated on it. So, like, I don't ever want to, like, 
have the debate or something. But I just be like, man, you know what? I love the Vita and love God. Anything deeper than that, that's for people to take that route if they want to. But me, man, I just be I just be trying to be in a good head of space. Like like you know like yeah, and then just be vibing. Yeah, no, it's fair. You know, are we still on or no? Yeah, it's okay. just the, the Wi Fi thing for them from this laptop. Okay. But when Ooh, when cool. was the last time you went to church? Oh, I just went Ooh. recently. Oh. Yeah, cause, yeah. For the hunger got married. That's why. It's not oh, it's yeah, not, that's right. It's not, it's not. It's not. It's not because I was not like, oh, I need God. Uh, oh shit! Yeah. I dropped that. No, yeah, cause um, yeah. The homegirl got married. The homegirl got married, and I was like, it's up. I'm up there. Hell yeah! And I was a groomsman, and it was fun. It was fucking litty. And you know, just, the last good. wedding I went to, I was 15. Full. You know, I haven't been to no fucking weddings. Even my wedding was not a wedding. I went to Vegas and got married in the drive-through. You know, which is fair. baby daddy. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Drive through fool. Yeah, I was nineteen. Oh shit! Like I was just like whatever. Want a hug? No, bitch. Uh, like uh, the uh, fuck. Uh, Sorry. No, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's just like you, you got married in a drive through. What I picked that? Why fool? How, what do you mean? We how were like, broke. How long did it take? Well, cause we were broke. It didn't matter. Like to me, I was. It was more about like I always knew that marriages just fall apart. So to me, I was just like, yo, like let's Not just focus always, on the though. marriage. No, I was like, let's focus on like what the fuck we got, and we did. We first of all, we shared an amazing like you know um, the amount of time we like did everything right. Like we have a son. Like even to this day, literally, we were texting today about like we need to meet with him at a fucking like we need to take him to dinner and talk to him because he's, he's wilding. Going, he's wilding right now. He's trying to be class clown. You know how that fucking shit is. Yeah, I'm you a piece did of it. Shit. I did it we all know what the fuck that oh, means oh so he's wilding right now your son he's wilding the counselor has to call me and like i gave him so many chances like blah blah they I, know I me that. at his school so now they're like you know we're not trying to really you know give us tickets you, but not. i'm just like i was gonna say um i seen the shit with your mom when that for him and your mom they broke something yeah they broke my fucking card that they spent <laughs> So I spent like fifteen hundred dollars for that at the pulga, and fucking he broke that shit, and then and then they just kept it quiet because I've been like I wonder why that I haven't seen that, but at the same time I'm so busy that I never really think. Yeah, yeah. And now yeah. I'm like they broke that shit. How many years ago was that? Two years ago because Wait, he, break? he had a different there? haircut. What did they break? A carrito, fifteen hundred dollars, bro. <laughs> it was like a cart that rolled down the hill. I like how your mom. Like, I like how your mom's like mijo. Yeah. Just fucking and she's like, I told you right. I told you right. I'm like, you didn't tell him shit. You let him ride that shit. And he, if it wasn't for, he was smart to jump off because he would have been fucked. So it's like, now I'm mad at my mom. She she even said, she was like, oh, estaba preocupada que te ibas a enojar conmigo. I'm like, yeah, he wasn't wearing a helmet. Had he not hopped off that shit, he would have crashed into the fucking fence. He could have got super hurt. And I'm just like, y'all are just so irresponsible. But I am yo haciendo pinches shows on the fucking road. That's why sometimes I get depressed. Cause I'm like, bro, I'm on the road working, and little do I know they're over here breaking fucking cars that go 20 miles per hour with no fucking helmet. That was, but you know what? Like my mom let my chivo die. A fucking oh, I, I, we're, we're fucking just chickens about die. I'm just like, I'm mad. Like, you can't fucking do this shit. <laughs> Shout out your son Because I'm like That fool's having the time of his life He's like I got a ranch I can fuck around in Oh I'm getting on Every single thing That has wheels And just doing it up That's what I would have done Yeah As like as like a reckless ass kid Like bro Like I, But 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 parent, Like you know The class class shit Could be a little tricky Because it's like Oh he's having a good time But he's also being a Like an asshole in class But that's funny when he's reckless on the ranch here and there, like I'll forgive it because I'm like the reason I bought a ranch was because I wanted him to be raised on a ranch. Yeah, so yeah, it's like, me. yeah, I want him to live live that life. But like when it comes to school, I'm like, you think you're entertaining? Like you think like your family runs an entertainment business and you ain't entertaining here. You want to be in class being entertaining. So what's gonna happen is now I gotta go to your class and I gotta fucking shadow you every single fucking oh, day. Parents Let's shadowing see what that's is the gonna best. fucking Yeah, that's what I told him. And then also because I, my tia, like, you know, I hired her, like what she does yeah. is she cooks meals every fucking day. And I'm like, he tells her, he's he'd be like, um, oh, I'm going to go down and I'm going to eat. But then he won't. So I'm like, if you need me to hand feed you, I will. But I'm also going to do it at school. And I'm going to watch all your little friends. Watch you have to have your mom feed you every fucking day. And he's just like, I'm like, yeah. So let's figure out what we're going to do. Because he got it. I think this is the toughest I've ever got. Like, oh, well, you're not four cool, days mom. ago. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, cool mom is this. You're not rapper mom right now. Mom is this. What's up? What What do you want? And he was like, so we're going to find out. Damn. No. Damn, if you got married at a drive-thru, I'm still tripping on that. And you didn't answer the question. Yeah, how long f- did it take? 
I don't did it. Too. Okay, I'm gonna keep it a buck. Can I keep it a buck? Okay, so I got married in Vegas, right? Yes, which I did think it was dope because honestly, I was okay. I was a huge Elvis fan when I was when I was a little girl. It comes down to like my dad used to work at like Albertsons, which is what like they don't have those anymore, do they? They do. Uh, yeah, they have just, maybe oh, was, like there's there's they're very limited. They're, they're yeah. super like taking over Target. So my so. dad used to fucking work at Albertsons in the meat department. So my dad he never had time to give me any gifts or anything. So he would just pick up whatever was in the like aisle. Yeah. So like he got he gave me like you know Elvis CDs Michael Jackson CDs like whatever the fuck was in the little fucking section that's what he gave me so I grew up like really looking up to like Elvis like I thought that was dope this pre-tiktok when we found out his whole life but whatever <laughs> so I thought getting married in Vegas at a fucking drive through was like fucking epic especially if you got married by Elvis I was like this is fucking cool like and also because I believe that like a lot of people end up in marriage I was just like okay cool like we'll get married let's focus instead of a honey or like instead of a thing like let's put it into like our future you know and which was smart because by 23 we owned a home we fucking our cars were paid off our debt was paid off like come on like are you serious like th- i yeah. think i was smart as fuck so how fast was it no yeah, well i was gonna say <laughs> okay if you didn't know how the marriage pro- process goes you go and you get your license right did you know that uh no i've never okay. been married okay so you show up, you get your license. That shit doesn't take very much. Mm, 20 minutes. You're waiting for whatever. The moment you walk out of Clark County license, there's like 30 people regateando, pulling you different directions, being like, I'll give you a marriage and uh, pictures for $20. I'll give you this for $30. I'll give you this. So they're just like pulling you. They're like, we have a limo. We have a Hummer. We have a this. We have a that. So they're just like, you're crazy. So then you went with Elvis. I went with the Hummer. So <laughs> we went... <laughs> We went with the Hummer and with a like, you know, yeah, it was like Elvis, Little Chapel, Hummer. We go with them. We get in the car. Then they're driving the fucking Hummer. Um, The Hummer crashes into the chapel. Should have known. The Hummer <laughs> crashed into the fucking drive through of the chapel and backs up, doesn't give a fuck, goes through the shit. So it took us a little longer. I feel like we could have got the whole marriage done in like an hour. Um, it took us a little longer because they were also like confirming like what the fuck the liability is or whatever. I think maybe like an hour and a half, two hours. Wow, fool. You had like a real hangover experience. Yeah. That's sick though, fool. Proud That's what I wanted. Shout out you, man. You and Elvis. Yeah. And baby dad. You know. Are you still married in the city of Nevada? No, we got a divorce. Oh, okay, yeah. I don't know. I don't know how that it works. It took forever to get a legal divorce, but. <laughs> <laughs> the city of Nevada too. And does he ever text you like, hey, cool song, fool? State. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. State of Nevada, <laughs> state of Nevada, yeah. city of Las Vegas, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. it's a county, Clark County. But um, yeah, they ever text you like, "Hey, fool, cool song." Yeah, yeah. yeah. At the beginning of our divorce, like hey, when fool, I started dating girls, when I started dating girls, they were he was like, "Oh, she's fine." <laughs> I was like, "Get please stay away from her." Damn, that's sick. No, shout out him. That's cool. Like, yeah, baby mom's a lesbian. She's sick though. Yeah, no, yeah. He's yeah. he's really cool, and now he's engaged. So it's like now it's like even extra. Are, are you are you going better. to his wedding? I don't you think have I'm, to go fool. first of all i don't think i'm invited and i don't i don't think i want to go like i think that's like for what like it's more no, of a like, but 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 i mean but you said you haven't got him you haven't got to wedding since you got or you since you were 15 yeah but i don't fool, care i don't fool. care for weddings there's so much fun fool why fool. what's fun about a wedding okay my shout out maria and junior they got married like uh they're 26 27 bro amazing time but not like I'm cool. Like, but 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 are you? Are, I mean, I don't. You don't, you don't have no, to answer. Cool. Get we're yeah. cool. We're super but, cool. Uh, we're super cool. What about you and his, his fiance? We're we're cool. You gotta go to the wedding, fool. You have to. I just don't know why I would fool. need to go. Like I'm cool. <laughs> what do you think? Like some of my exes still hang out with him and his wife and his family and oh, all yeah, that shit. That but oh, see, oh, see, that might be a little more tricky where you don't run around. But I think fool like if. Like if they're like, hey, you know what? Like, um, <laughs> snow. Like we're having the wedding. We will. Okay. Would you? Would you have said yes if she wanted you to be part of her bridesmaids? That's fucking. Like <laughs> that's, that's not weird. weird. It's not weird. That's fucking. Because it's strange. like one of those situations where like, yeah, I don't think that's weird. But if if you do get invited, I feel like you should definitely go. You might regret it. Like, uh, you know what? You're, but you guys are cool in the so. sense to where like you gotta like. No, like I, I'm, I'm okay. Like there would be no reason that I have a problem with it. It's just more like, it's more like, <laughs> right? I just get up. Hey, like, I'm the love of your life. life. No, remember no, Elvis? No. <laughs> <laughs> just starts, no, you gotta go, fool. I think that'd be amazing. I don't want to though. Like, like the reason I haven't gone to weddings is because I don't want to. 
You know what I mean? So it's like oh, so now, you have been invited to weddings. Yeah. I well, just, now I'm not gonna invite you to my wedding when I get married because you don't want to fucking go. No, I'll I'll go to yours. But you you wouldn't go to it's your. It's like it's like how much do I not want to go versus versus who it is? You know uh, what I mean? It's like it's like it's like you know if if I don't want to go but but the person is like dope then then I might go like because it's like even though uh, I so don't, he's not dope. <laughs> I'm just fucking. Her. I'm just talking. It's my <laughs> ex husband and his new no, girl. But, like, but I think, but I think, I think if they were like, hey, you know what, Snow, we, you feel me? Like your son's gonna be here. Obviously, shout out your son. Like, hey, we would love for you to come if you could make it. I feel like you should just even go eat a plato and leave. I give. I buy my own plato. Thank you. I appreciate. I feel it. like you should go. Try. Like I might send them a gift. And yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. You know like, what? Sending a gift. A, yeah, I don't think I need to go. Like I'll send them a gift, but that's like a nice gesture. But that's. <laughs> Your that's chat, it. Your chat's funny. Speak now yeah. forever. Hold your pee there. Everybody just turn their on and stare. That's no. <laughs> I'm good. You just, you just, you just mm-hmm. confirm like, I'm uh, I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm good. Damn, that's crazy. Because I, I, I have homies that their parents aren't together no more and they have new relationships. Mm-hmm. And they're like, just be kicking it, getting drunk, talking shit, like dark humor. Like, I think it's dope. I think it's funny. Like, yeah, no, I'm sure that like, that could still happen. Like, I, he's been invited to like several, like, we have a son, so we still yeah, like super you know, kick it, yeah, like yeah, cool, but cool like fun. but like a wedding. I'm like, bro, let let's make it about her. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think I don't think a wedding should be like people checking <laughs> on his ex wife how she feels. I think it should be like, yo, girl, have your moment. I chose mine to be a drive through. You chose your yours to be a ceremony. Good for you. You know, like. What did they ask you for? Like, like to be a madrina. Imagine her family members are like fucking fans of mine. Now I'm like, oh damn! Now that's I'm fucking sick, taking. Though. That's like, fucked hey. up. I'm just coming through. Like, sh- no, 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 no. That's rude. That's rude. I don't like. If that. my ex got married, I would go to her wedding. You're an asshole. Why? You're just gonna show up and make eye contact with the bitch? No, 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 no. Like, like, like. Well, one of my exes, I probably wouldn't go. She broke my heart. It hurts. Um, <laughs> but, but like, if like, like, I have a homegirl named Camila. That's was my ex. Like, uh, like you feel me? Like. One of the first everything's, you know what I'm saying? Like, and we we're cool. Like, if like if she were to bring a man, I'd be like, "What's up, Berito? You want a shot?" Like, we 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 obviously like the same things. You know, that's <laughs> the conversation I'm avoiding. That's the conversation I don't want to. I don't want to do that. Like, I've met his ex. I mean, I've met his girl three, maybe three amazing, times. Amazing, amazing girl. Three times. We've had good conversation as far as like my biggest thing is like Your res- son. respect for my son. Yeah, facts. Respect for like, you know, my privacy, my, you know, my everything and mutual and that's it. Like that's 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 the depth of our situation. Like mm. there's no it ain't that deep. You, you know? should go to the wedding for. That'd be sick. She did ask me if I always knew I was lesbian. I was like, that's a little like what are, what are you talking about here? <laughs> <laughs> Like the first time I had a conversation with Imagine her. Imagine she was like, I'm feeling that way too now. I'm dead. <laughs> no, but yeah, like she she did ask me that. Like, like, did I always know that I was lesbian? Um, is that why we broke up? Like, did I like just You got questions. all emotional and shit a little bit? No. I think she was just more trying to dig like, did I like was I really fucking with him? And I'm like, uh-huh. I mean, I wasn't inseminated, like I didn't get pregnant like through a doctor. Like, I mean yeah. we I'm not the virgin know? Mary, I feel it. I'm like, you know, what do you what answer are you looking for? But that was about it. And I think that's most of the reason why I don't need to be there because I'm like we've had our conversation. It's good. Pass the baton. Go ahead, girl. Do your thing. Pass <laughs> like, the baton is crazy. What? You know what? If you get the courage to go and you need a date, I'll be your date, Snow. Get the courage to go. I don't need courage. To go. <laughs> I feel like you should go. Weddings are fun, dude. There's so much fucking fun. Look like at this point, I'm only gonna get invited so you can go. <laughs> Like, like if if he sees this or if his dad sees this, um, I mean, if, or if my son sees this, he's gonna um, his dad, my son, yeah, yeah. um, there he's gonna invite you. And yes, then I'll I, be, I will. Um, I'll be your date. Yeah, yeah. I'll be like, <laughs> hey, you guys, like, do I have a plus one? Yes. I'll be like, let's do it up. I'm so down to go on a fucking wedding, bro. There's so much fucking fun. That's gonna be so bro, like, out a, of a fool, me. My homegirl got married, and it was like I never been to a wedding before. Also, we're very young, so people don't get married our age. It was a rare thing. Mm. Good fucking time, fool. Hell yeah. That shit was sick. I feel like you're going to be invited to like more and more fancy shit. And I think you're going to have a fucking blast because you're just the really. I love that. Like the, the concept of you showing up and being a fucking desmadre to like yeah. the, the lit shit. That's what I be doing. But it doesn't. It goes a lot better with a man than it does with a woman. Me, sometimes I just go, ay, pobrecita, borrachita. <laughs> <laughs> no, you need to come around. Bro, you know what? Like, like whenever I meet and like, you know, like. 
like my my family and my friends do a real good job of keeping me like very humble and just like I love being with my day ones. I've known them since high school. Like we have a good fucking time together. Like we, I don't treat them any different when I'm around whoever I'm around with. Like, yeah, you know they get treated the same way. Like if I have like let's say I go to somewhere and they feed me, I'm like bro, my, my homie need to eat too. Like you mm -hmm. know I'm I'm just like I'm very like close. I'm very they uh, friendship and like family and like close friends. Oh yeah. And who keeps me um like very humble? I bring them around, and then I always tell them, bro, I'll be like, bro, I know this person would love to come here. So you gotta come to one of those things where we have a kind of like just come kick it, get lit as fuck. And and my homies are like super good at like when they invite people and they know I'm there, like fool, don't ask the homie like we're hanging out, fool, don't ask the homie about who he fucking interviewed, don't do none yeah. of that shit. Like we're just here to hang out. I love that. Yeah, so you I can come that. whenever you and your you you and your entourage, your family, yeah, your brother, my brother, come do it up. <laughs> Usually wherever I go, I'm like, it's me and my brother, it's me mm -hmm. and my brother, my cousin, like that's it. Like if I remember, I, see if I remember his name because it sounds like cocaine. Uh, Yayo. No, Yayo's my that's cousin. A, Ido, that's our cousin. That's Ido. Name, yeah. Yayo's the one. No, 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 no. For, I know your brother. Your cousin's the one that came in. Yeah. With the boiler. That's, that's yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah, that, yeah, with yeah. the boiler. That's that's where I remember his name from. Yeah, Yayo. Yeah. Which yeah. is crazy, right? That yeah. it's like I don't do cocaine, but it's like my cousin Yayo, me, Snow. Like fucking what the hell's going on? <laughs> Who fucking named y'all? It's just so <laughs> fun. Whole name of full of like it's like subliminal coke names. That's crazy. No, I mean his name came from like a homeless man in Huchipila Zacatecas. Like I don't I have no idea what the fuck that was about, but <laughs> what what just, word did you say? But, Huchipila, Zacatecas. Is that where you guys are from? Mm -hmm. Huchipila, Zacatecas. Yeah, that's where we're from. One of the best mezcals I've ever drank is from Zacatecas. No, yeah, yeah, Zacatecas. Shout out my ex Sandy, lit, bro. Um, yeah, look, pull up Tastuanes. Maybe, maybe pull up like Tumbadas, Tastuanes, or something like that. Just because it's like people don't know about this shit, but like I'm, mind you, maybe I'm not gonna get it lit, but like I, I'm at least gonna have it at my. Quince, like the Quince event thing that I'm doing. Yes. At this point, no, bro. It's not even about promo. It's about I know that, like, let's say, like, if I was to ever die, knock on wood, no. but, like, I know that I want one show where, like, I, I, I just, like, maybe my childhood traumas are, like, healed or something, yeah. and it's, like, that's what I'm doing. Like, bro, I'm overspending because I'm, like, banda, that's tuanes. Like, I want everything to be the shit that, like, when I was 15, like, maybe I couldn't fucking do, we couldn't afford, like, I couldn't, whatever. Like, I want that shit. And so we come from a small place. It's even smaller than Cuchipila, by the way. Cuchipila's small. And then it's like La Mesquitera is like over here somewhere. And there's like and dirt like roads. Tiny. It's like dirt roads. It's like fucking nothing. So it's like La Mesquitera is where they do this shit. And I want to bring these motherfuckers to Hollywood at the Palladium. Because look at this shit. Go. I'm from there, bro. That's the church. Like. Are you wish you got married? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was helping that, that preschool. I would help teach. Um. And that's what they do. And so what they do is they knock each other down. Like they do this and they like shake their dreads basically. So nobody they, can see. They got masks. They got these these uh they get they get lit. They got these wood masks. They got these cow tails. All that is cow tails on top. They got leather and they got um steel toe boots. They kick the shit out of each other and knock each other down. And they do all that for the Santo Santiago. And I don't know, just something about the tambora and them fucking like knocking each other out and getting crazy that it's like fucking lit. Like, it's just like, that's what you do in July. You go to Las Fiestas, you get all dressed up. You know how it is in, like, in Mexico, you get dressed up to, like, go to this event. And then we're just getting down? Look, yeah. Like, they just fucking knock each other down. There's a baby right there. Like, I don't know what the fuck is going on. Look. Hell yeah. And they get rowdy. Like, they just fucking, look. Play it. This shit looks maniac out. Look yeah. I feel like that shit is like that's what I grew up on, bro. So like to this me, this is like I'm a like, bad dream to me. It's like a monster's coming to get me. It's no, just a it's fucking. They're, they're play another kid. video. They're a little scary looking, huh? That's what I think is dope. I want a music video of this shit because I'm like, bro, I want one of them just fucking wilding in a music video, just like, cause like if you think about it, it's a masked person coming at you with a crazy ass fucking hat. Just look, play anything, you know. That top one right there where they're wilding. What's the volume? I don't think they got the squabbles here. Yeah, it seems. Like no. I think I think the one right under that had the squabbles. Yeah. We're picking the that one. Yeah, that one, that one. This like at a school. This is a, this is a school one. Oh yeah. This Montera fell. That's a Montera. You you knocked the Montera off. And that's a small band though. That's that's two, that's a three piece band right there. That's just more of the vibe. <laughs> put one with the tambora though. I like I like I feel like how people this be like, cool. yeah, man, I feel impress this bitch. Let me put this mask on. Oh yeah, they get lit, and then they get the girls to do it. There, there's a day that's only girls, and then when the girls do it, they it, you're right because the bitches be fighting way too dramatic. They'll take the fucking montera off and then they'll fight. Look. 
Nice. I gotta go do this. Look at that. Hey. Oh, sh <laughs> this is for fun, too. Yeah. How and then they get him. Look, they help him get up and then they. Or not. Yeah. Have you seen or the videos? Put a tambora, though. <laughs> this is. Who's knocked out? <laughs> what the so fuck? <laughs> you you want to have this on the Hollywood, Hollywood Palladium stage? I'm like, fuck insurance. I'm like, I don't know what's happening, but this shit is wild. I'll put the fucking one. The, right, Life Nation is going to kick me out. They're going to be like, oh, you're never getting booked anywhere again. Facts, you know, go bro. to another video, bro. Play something with Tambora, because right now you're playing all the fucking three. Have you seen... Which one? Fuck, what the Have you seen the down? ladies getting down in Peru? In the big circle? No. Have you seen that? Aposol. Play the Aposol ones. Right there. Have you seen that, Bedix? When the, when the señoras get down? Look. Pero sube la música, cause we gotta hear this tambor. I wanna see it. Oh, this is so sick. Puta madre. Imagine, you're lit as fuck. The music, the banda's fucking going. Everybody's wilding and they're fighting and shit. I love that shit. So, so for what happens once you get knocked out? You get kicked out like, oh, you're a lame. Get out of here. No, they just fucking keep going. Like you, I mean, you're you're lame for getting kicked. I mean, I'm sure whoever's watching you is like saw you get knocked down, but you just mm. keep on going. And Have you seen the one of the the girls that Peru get down? No, bro, look we'll that up that. real quick, bro. Like, bro, yeah. you're gonna trip. I don't even know the name. Just put a uh, ladies in Peru fighting. <laughs> ladies in Peru, and they just get like they get together like in like 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 it's just like a big ass fucking like thing. And they just squabble it out. Look, 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 look. They just get down. Oh yeah, you seen this? Seen it, it on it, TikTok. It, bro, uh, yes. What's you know? What's your ads looking like? <laughs> you know what the heck is that? <laughs> That's my brother's ads. <laughs> oh, he needs glasses, fool. Oh. <laughs> no, well, the first one was some ladies' pee. <laughs> that? Oh, oh, it's because okay. you went to the hospital. Uh, now we get a freaking English bagel. Nice. All right, let's see. Dude, this shit is. But they got like squabbles. Like I feel like these girls will beat up a lot of girls living. Got su puta madre. Look, hey, yo. <laughs> yo, you never seen it before, you know? No. <laughs> they got the one of the guys too, but the fool, they're like, they squabble, fool. Like, that shit is crazy. I sometimes, I sometimes go like on a deep dive and watch like the, and it's like a tradition. I it's know. the most replayed moment. They said, bitch, ain't no hair pulling, bitch. That's how bitches should fight in Hollywood. Like, fool, like, it's cracking. Fuck like, you. like, 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 it's, it's putazos, fool. Like, they're chunking him, fool. Like. They said, my <laughs> hair's braided, bitch. You ain't pulling shit. And I think it's, I think it happens maybe God, like, in, like, damn. In, like, in, like, in, like, in, like, maybe, like, blocks and, and, and places to where, like, we're gonna fucking, this is how we're gonna settle our differences and beefs. Love watching this, by the way. Love watching them just squabble it out. I also seen someone of some ladies in Salvador just squabbling yeah but, it's lit but what is the what is the well, like the how goal. do they decide I yeah the like what I is know. it's obviously a tradition that people are just gathering in a circle like before they're throwing hellmakers look 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 bow they go hey, boom bro that's a big ass fight boom that's a no hair pulling, by the way. Very respectful squabbling. Yeah, they got they got a fucking. They clearly are organized because they, they got they got uniforms. Yeah, they got the skirt, they got the shoes, they got the fucking long sleeve black okay, shirt. Okay, so let, so I'm I'm trying to look. Oh oh, shorty showed up with the jeans. Hold on. She's nervous. No, she's nervous. Nah, she can't. Yeah do it. yeah. See I'm, the way she's holding. Oh, it. Yeah, just nah, makers. Oh, oh, the one with the jeans. She got guy. one or two. She got one or two. Not gonna lie. Hey, hold on. If we think they go eat lomo saltado after this. <laughs> but there is not one KO, bro. Where's a KO? I want to see. Like, I don't think they let him get two KO. Like, I, damn, bro. But four pounds of pressure on your chin or your jaw will do it. Like, so that means that they ain't. Dude, that's just crazy, uh. Dude with the raincoat said. Well, they have the guys one too. Let me see the guys one, cause I don't want to just to just be women doing this. What's up? Like, <laughs> fool, they're fucking. Uh huh. Well, you know that Peru. No, 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 uh huh. Like, Boy, just squabbling. <laughs> hey, yo. Oh, she was a puta mo Yo, that's Fool, straight You punches. didn't know about this, Benix? That's just straight. That's you and your boys about seat check. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who got necked right Fule, now? Fule, let's do it, Peru style. And then they hug each other. Yo, somebody didn't seat check. Now they got to fucking squabble it out. 
Damn! Before they like a stage performers? What are they actually performing one of these? <laughs> Would you be down? I'm like, I'm lucky that, I, that I'm on the show. I'm bringing Tastuanes. Imagine if I was Peruvian and I got to bring this shit to the fucking Palladium. <laughs> Like damn, and and, and 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 I've always wondered wait. That guy's I, a little gay though. He's like he better knock him out. Gay. Look, I'm rooting for the gay guy. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, he kicking and everything. Oh, I'm rooting. Oh, is this a gay fight? Oh, I'm rooting for him. Hold on. Gay vibes? Yeah, no, game. that one, that one is was gay. The gay fight is crazy. The gay, they got a rainbow right there. They got the rainbow yeah. hat right there. That's no secretly just going to support the the Peru church tribes. Yo, no, they got no gay people. Be angry inside. I'm not gonna lie. Look. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, so okay, so I'm trying to figure this out, right? Like, I'm thinking, like, okay, let's say this happens in November, maybe October. And we, me, let's say me and you get into argument in January. We can't I'm find... I'm dead. Salise Rose is Peruvian. I'm sorry, by the way, if, <laughs> if you find it, this offense. I, this is dope, actually. This is like, fun. If but you want to do this with me and you... <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> If you want to punch me in the face, I'll totally. It's fine. From Celise Rose? <laughs> yeah, she a bad one. <laughs> it's a joke. It's a fucking joke. You know what? But look. Don't worry about it. I just don't want to be making fun of no. I just think this is fucking fire. Oh, they like, knocked each other out. They both. I love his hairstyle. Oh, how'd that happen? Damn! I was trying to go to Peru to do some ayahuasca. I did not know they were gonna fucking knock me the fuck out. <laughs> like what the fuck? I'm okay, to... so this is my thing, right? Them hats is fire though. What's yeah, that? hats is super fire. By Yo, the way, can we order sure those? Tumbada right there, hey. Hondo amiga. Okay, so this is my thing, right? Let's say we have a problem in January. Bro, I'm, tri- I know I'm a fucking. I, I know I love alcohol because I'm starting to feel like I'm about to go out. It's six forty-seven. Oh my. Okay, so God. this is my thing. Let's say I have like, let's say, traditionally we're not allowed to fight in the tribe, right? Take or, a drink with me because. Or in the puente or whatever, where wherever we're in the, in the in the pueblo, you have to settle your differences in November. In, in November, like wherever or whatever time this happens, in whatever, right? Are you like training like through, from January to November to get the squabbles off when Fuck you gotta yeah. squabble in front of the whole fucking tribe? Fuck yeah, I'm I'm like, like I'm training because they might be training. So it's like now by November, let's say I'm not training because I'm like yeah I ain't th- I ain't tripping. I'm trying to act cool. And then they got and then they've been squabble. fucking wilding on the fucking you know. Canelo out. All of a sudden now bitches is like you know no. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm for the sport. I don't know if it's a sport. I mean, fighting is a sport, so yeah, I'll, I'll let that. I, I want to go to Peru just to see that happen. But also, we have to understand that, like, obviously, right? Indigenous people, like, we all come from indigenous people. Yeah, like, you know. Um, so it's like if you really think about it, if all of them were doing something to settle your differences, like for example, Tastuan is, you know, you get to do that and you do that. Peruvian, you're, you're, you know, squabbling and fucking figuring that out. Like if indigenous people knew, hey, let's settle our differences and then let's move on. Yeah, that's the right way to fucking do it. Not the for whole sure. Being passive aggressive and being weird and going corporate and telling HR and fucking getting someone <laughs> fired and getting someone deported, like that type of shit is fucking pussy. Like, yeah, squabble and fucking figure out your differences and figure out the pecking order in this bitch chickens do it yeah facts you know it's like what's i up? like the indian slaps too i've seen the indians do slap the shit God on each damn, you just be watching people harass bro, each other bro look indians up the indians slap- slapping oh each other in the chest God, bro, Jesus. you see those bro that shit looks oh, fucking crazy they said in my training for my arm wrestle <laughs> oh yeah jenny 69 um said we got an arm wrestle and so now we're training because I we, I want to come out with everything. She was she said, let me find out. See, uh, Santa Fe is gonna walk you out to our fucking wrestling competition. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yo, we gotta have boxer. Bro, if Santa Fe walks you out to your fucking arm wrestle with with Jenny sixty nine, I think I think nah, Jenny Loki look a little strong, huh? No, that's what I was saying. She yeah, she Loki look a little strong. Was, arm was, look a little buff. It was too random that she's like, you want to arm wrestle? And I was like, what? And she's like, let's arm wrestle, like let's bet. And I'm like, that makes me feel like. What you know? If, if Jenny sixty nine was like, "Hey, we should kiss," would you be? Would you? Would, would you would have been down or no? No, she's married. What if like her husband's like it to go? It's good. No, I don't kiss girls. I don't like. I don't ask for a man's permission if I can kiss. No, no, girl. no, no. What if like she They're asked married. her man? I don't want. Hey, some people swing. We don't know. I'm okay. I'm not a swinger. Is it? But you're single. So if you're if I'm you're single, single, then okay. What if she just late night texts? Hey, Snow, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm like, uh, I'm chilling. What's up? Can I pull up? 
what are you, for, are you sure like All i'm right. not assuming like anything <laughs> Like she might pull I'm, up to a party. Like, what you mean? I don't know. I don't like. Okay, contrary to popular belief, there's a lot of there's there's some masked lesbians or some lesbians that are totally fine with all that. Me personally, I I respect actual like marriage, fiance, you know, all that shit. Like, I'm respectful of that. You know, if you still live with your baby daddy, I don't think you're single. I don't give a fuck if you tell me like he's fine with it. I don't give a fuck about. Oh, his you're opinion. not fucking somebody that got a uh, a man or a, another girlfriend. No, I've talked to somebody that literally lives with her baby daddy. All that shit. Like, no, that but doesn't mean it, you single. Like, I don't give a fuck. Wasn't it thrilling a little bit? Huh? Like, yeah, it takes me only after so x amount of time no like we we still could kick we we homies or whatever like it's it's cool but like don't think i'm taking you seriously don't ever think oh, i'm yeah, taking yeah, you seriously oh. if you got but somebody you're not down to be the side? i don't i'm not down to be that i'm not down to be the gradient the 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 blend from this to this i'm not down to be the next on the monkey bars i'm not down to no like meet me cuz you single and you know what the fuck you're doing and you also know you gay I'm not being no experiment. Like, oh, I'm not gay, but I'll try it for you. Fuck you. I don't need you to try nothing for me. Like, fuck out of here. Like, yeah, I'm not to be um the experiment. Yeah, you could. Yeah, experiment. Yeah, I'm, 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 I, yeah, I'm, I'm not to be the side. Yeah, like you got a man to go home to. I promise I won't text you after X amount of time. Like, yeah, send me his schedule, send me your schedule. I want to text accordingly. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm down for all that. Yeah, I'm not to be like the, like you know, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can't. Nah. Cause you let a lame hit. No, I'm hitting. That's not a prize. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you let I'm a sorry. lame hit. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? Like, what? Yeah, I'm nah, supposed I'm, to be in competition with that guy? Like, uh, I gotta look at the guy and be like, God. Now, if the guy is like, you know, I'll be like, oh, okay, bad. We in the fucking. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You gotta type. You know, but like, you got that guy and you got me. Fuck out of here! Like, oh, I give it. So her, so her husband got to be hot. Well, no, I'm not. I'm not talking about her no more. Now I'm talking about other shit. Like I'm subbing people that you don't even know right oh, now. I'm, oh, well, fuck! I know where you were going. Shots there. is fired right now. Oh. We are not even talking about what you talking about. Mm. I'm over here. Bam, bam, bam. And would no, you I'm ever joking. do a reality show with all your exes to come in one room? Oh my god, no! I'll kill I feel myself. like we should do that. <laughs> no, I would. I think they'd all agree on one thing. Cheers. Cheers to you and love. You don't even got no fucking drink. You a liar. You, you Yo, anyone who's dating, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Dude, the Indian food squabbling prison. This is a speedo Man. fight right now. No, what the hell? Was that fool like that like got my dad's mustache. Bro, that fool look like my dad. What the <laughs> no, fuck? Indian food's dad? My dad saying. got that Why mustache. Why like Indian? My dad definitely. Fool, <laughs> watch this shit. Look, look, look. Bro, why are they going sideways? <laughs> they just slapped the shit out of each other. <laughs> the fact, oh. <laughs> wait, run that shit back. Fool, the I'm fat green. You. Wait, the fat green shorts isn't knocking the fuck out the other dude just based off mass alone, and then he gets he gets thrown. He got necked, bro. He got necked. He said. But look, but look. <laughs> By the way, it's fucked up because there's no women in sight, so you know we're in a third world country. <laughs> Oh, he tried to hit him with a fucking no. <laughs> Hold on, pause, that. Look, 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 look. pause that and run it back. Wait, he tried to hit him with a fucking sneak and he still didn't look. <laughs> he tried to make he it look. He ate that. He ate that. It went to his love handles. Oh, they're not slapping the face. Oh! Well, he comes back for another round. Wait, did you see his... Did you see the other guy? Let's call skinny and fucking green shorts. Yeah. He's punching his chest the whole time until he hits him in the face. That's a look technique. Look. Chest, chest, chest. Chest. Boom. Boom. But by the way, the, for the way this will fall, he's a professional slap faller. <laughs> he's like, he's coming back with momentum. He's like, oh, now I'm pissed. Oh, and then he's running. <laughs> Dude, you never seen this? Fuyaga with them gotta be way more cooler. Please start just sending me random I'll shit. I'll send you a gang of random shit if you want me to. Yeah, I'm on like below, lesbian below. heartbroken TikTok. What, I need to be on this fuck? shit. What the fuck is this? Then again, men love to watch men. So, it makes sense. <laughs> but there's no men in my algorithm. It's all girls. Why? Because I like girls. I know, but fool, like... Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look, he's about to get lit here, fool. Oh. 
Oh, <laughs> Dog, what the, the fuck? Head, the head bob backwards is crazy. Oh, Oh, okay. but look, they have like... What are the rules, though? What are the I rules? I don't fucking know, but Snow, they speak a whole other language. I just watch the shit because there's pain involved. <laughs> if I was to go back to his tribe and win no fucking oil. <laughs> Sound like it fucking hurts though, fool. I feel like it hurts more when they got dirt, bro. I feel like the dirt hurts. She slapped the, the shit out of his back. I'm not gonna lie, have you ever slapped the shit out of somebody like that? Yes. It hurts your hand, bro. Yes. Like now your fucking wrist hurts. Like goddamn, oh. bro. I'm gonna show you a video of me slapping the shit out of him with a blood for yes. mouth. Let me find it. Send it to my brother. Bro, I Play it. I wanna see a instant while. replay. And, and, and that shit got me banned from Instagram when I posted on my story. Oh my god. For a whole month. Yo, you gotta run and slap? That's This is a lot. I just wanna know the people that are watching, like, could they do this? Like, is it more like no, a bitch no you could I'll never? Fool. Getting slapped, it makes you feel like such a bitch. Like, it just, like, it's, it's fucking, it gets you mad. I don't like that shit. I gotta find this video. This video is fucking hilarious. <laughs> Bedix, it was at your house, hot huh, Bedix. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> the guy that jumped, it was for no reason because that looked like it hurt him more than the other guy. <laughs> Jumping into a fucking slap. <laughs> <laughs> like, I think he thought it was going to go way better than that. <laughs> oh, I this video. <laughs> Dog, I'm telling you that shit is vicious as fuck. <laughs> like it's so bad. <laughs> I'm dead. No, bro. Oh my god. Where's he going? I can't believe you've never seen this before, fool. One of the I funniest, haven't. one of the funniest things ever on the internet. Bro, I literally like I. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. I think I got it. Oh my god, I found it. <laughs> you have your airdrop? Airdrop? Look at this shit. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. That's. He let the blood. God damn. But fool, he's got him. He's killed me too. Where well, like, you got a bitch back there? Hey, go oh ahead, yeah, my boy. Zoom in. Look. <laughs> and by the way, this is planned. <laughs> no, look, look. <laughs> keep the laugh because the homie's laughing at the blunt. Look. <laughs> Dude, it gets bad. And me and my homies gets bad. Like, it just get. It, it sometimes become a little too much to where we gotta be like, oh, alright, we can't play like this in front of certain people because they get they were like assholes and shit like that. Yeah, I mean, Jesus, yeah, yeah. the whole fucking then that's it. You guys slapped each other and it's all good. And then he's like, I got you, fool, I got you. And then he got me back. Did he get you? What? How did he, he get you he back? He killed me in the, uh, at Vons. No, oh yeah, when I was sitting down playing uh, FIFA, he necked the fuck out of me bad to where like. Yeah, it was bad, fool. It was bad. Oh my god. But but I mean it's just like homie shit like this. But that one was legendary because the blunt fell. Yeah. That was pretty fucking funny. That was you, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Uh, did you feel you 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 were just like, I'll get over it? Yeah. I was like, this happens every day. Oh my gosh, are you okay? Do you yeah, feel like you're okay? Like I'm fucking, you make it seem like I'm fucking putting food on a toe code and just I'm like okay. you can't fucking go anywhere and then we gotta hang out and teach you here like shit. No, nah, it gets it gets it gets pretty litty. Oh my god, my manager fucking texted me like if the fucking yeah, man. I mean, I think I think it's fucking you know I think it's dope to have rules or have um what is it called like within groups like for example right here with the ranch right like we have this ranch we got seven buildings everybody's in different fucking little situations I think if we came up with like a certain sub set of rules yeah. like that the moment you come into the ranch these are the rules even for guests I think that would be dope. It's yeah. like if you don't this or that like now like and then we just become like super indigenous with it and we're like you must indigenous. have we're like we you must have a fucking you know like 
the sumo wrestling uh, fight in the middle of the fucking basketball court. Yes. At 5 p.m., you know? But, but I own sumo wrestling suits. Fire, amazing. I got to buy yeah. some of those. Oh, no, but see, you got to do it. Okay, like, what's something that your brother does that annoys you, but it's funny? <laughs> Like, 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 it's funny, but he's like, oh, my fucking God. He's an asshole. My brother, for the most part, is an asshole. So, like, let's say now you guys have a tip jar in every single building in the thing. And if he's being a dick, like, you got to tip the jar and then you make up a rule, like, like, you know, with yeah. that, with that. Yeah. yeah. Like That's a tip awesome. jar, like a, like a swear you jar. You got to help me come up with a declaration of, uh, or like with a of constitution. Of the ranch, declaration the of the ranch. ranch. Yeah. <laughs> Be like, all right, these are the rules everywhere in the fucking ranch. Cause I do gotta admit, like I feel like people respect certain rules coming from like dudes more than they do from women. When I say it, I'm a bitch, but if like a dude says it, it's like these are the rules. It's like, oh yeah, huh, yeah, no, nah, you never, you, yeah. It's like it's it, it's funny because it turned into something that wasn't serious until like it's like an unwritten rule. Like yeah, like this that C check shit gets it gets pretty serious. Like hey, fall sitting there, fool. That's what you're gonna do. Because then there's gonna come a time to where you sh you were supposed to sit here, but you broke the rule once, so now I gotta break it back with you. Yeah. So it's like, hey, fool, like you can't be breaking no fucking rules with. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, shit. I yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah, we should make some for sure. I'm gonna go out um, with you guys one time, and I'm gonna take my brother. Yes. But you gotta, but he, you gotta let him know the rules, and then he, it applies to him too. Okay, perfect. Like he's gotta forget. Like if y'all need to neck him, or he needs to neck y'all. <laughs> need to neck him. I want to see. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, don't jump my brother, but I just want to <laughs> just snakes the fuck out of us. Because he hangs out with me. You know, it's like I want to see him around like boys. Like y'all, y'all be just dudes. You know, that's funny. <laughs> that's cool. Y'all be y'all do that. He ain't yeah. gonna neck me. He gonna neck Snap me. my fucking yeah wig <laughs> off my fucking head. Neck. Turtleneck. Oh, I wear turtlenecks for Thanksgiving. That's my main. Do you love Thanksgiving? Yes. Well, I'm. I'm. I'm like a big holiday person. I've had a birthday where people were like, "What do you want for your birthday?" I'm like, "I want Thanksgiving dinner for my birthday. My birthday's in the summer." And I'm like, "I don't give a fuck." Like, so you ham. want like turkey, ham I want for ham, your birthday? Turkey, fucking macaroni, mashed potatoes, fucking pumpkin pie. Like, I want all that shit. Like, I want the entire pumpkin pie for your birthday. It's crazy. You just get like tres leches or something. No, the, well, yeah, that's my cake for the birthday. But I'm saying like with dinner. Like I want it to be just Thanksgiving in the middle of the summer. I don't give a fuck. Like I love, I love to eat. What People do you do Thanksgiving out here? Like what do you mean? Like with like, us? like like where do you usually celebrate it? We just eat it like we just it be like just us. I think it's like max like four people, five people. Oh, sure, yeah. I know. For you, we don't have a mom or dad, bro. Like you don't get it. For you want a hug again? Like you have a, <laughs> you have a nice mom, bro. I seen her. Me and us, like she be doing her thing, bro. Like and she's also very funny. You met her. Yeah, she's I met funny her. I as, met fuck. Her. Cool as fuck. She's funny as fuck. But it's just more like she she be on her own time, you know. Shorty's a, she she's a she's a runner. She's a track star. It's okay. Feel okay for. <laughs> I'm not crying. I'm okay. There's a lot of girls that want to play mommy for me, so it's. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's completely fine. It's good. My traumas are just gonna get me through the universe. Oh my fucking god! Fucking snows of food, dog. What? I mean, you're just like you're just like I don't have a mom or a dad, and you know, just just me and my go to my brother. Yeah, we're just. Do you want to pet me and treat me like a puppy? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Who cooks? You do? No. The fuck? You don't fucking cook, fool. I mean, I could cook a mean steak, but what? Who's cooking? Who's cooking for? Girls. Or my tia. Like, my tia So, cook. every year you hire, you like, you like. Hire? Like, like, no, I mean, so every year, like a week yes. before Thanksgiving, you tell a girl how much you love her. Hey, can you cook for Thanksgiving? No, they, no. They, like, who wouldn't want to spend Thanksgiving with me? What do you mean? Your mom and your dad. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fuck, dick. you your mom and your dad is a crazy response, but you know what? You're right. You're absolutely right. But yeah, like like, cause food, like I'm a, I'm gonna keep it a buck. Cooking a cooking like a ham or a turkey, I feel like that's very very skilled. Like things you gotta know how to cook. I mean a ham, a ham. Like I've definitely done a ham. I mean I remember one time we we had just gotten off tour. And like literally the next day was Thanksgiving. So everybody was at my house and I think we pulled it together. I think it's like we got a, this and that and whatever. Bayarta makes it mad easy because they'll prep the whole fucking shit for you. You just got to stick yeah, that man. shit. Stick that shit. In the, you might extra season it and extra butter it, but you're going to stick that shit in the oven. So I don't think it's that difficult. Like I've when I don't have someone who can do it, I can definitely do it or, you know, together. Yeah. But 
you know, if there's if there's somebody around that want to fucking kick in and they're like, you know, they they love to show their 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 feminine skills and I love that shit for them, you know? That's fucking yeah. awesome. But yeah, like what's what you mean? And also like my tia, she's here, she's amazing. You you saw her earlier like Yeah, yeah, no, no, she was dope. I seen her at the at the show. Yeah. She, 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 was like, she was helping you get yeah. ready for the dress or something yeah, like that. Yeah, because my mom doesn't want to be around me. Like, you know, my tia's there. And, and she's always has been. She's been, yeah. my tia's been around since I was like a little girl. So she's always known, like, you know, my mom's special. That's, that's always okay. crazy how somebody can have that much of, like, a big heart to, like, mother or father, somebody that's not theirs. It's a trip, huh? Yeah. yeah well, in our it. family, always, like, when girls were, like, 15, like, somebody else, like, took the, you know. So Initiative. Like, so, like, she, like, like, she went and lived with my mom when she was 15. I went and lived with my tia when I was 15. You mm. know, like, it just kind of, like, always, you know, and now my tia's here helping me and my son's 13. Like, it just, I don't know, we, as a family, that's our tradition. Our thing. Yeah. Because, you know, I don't yeah. know, sometimes people didn't weren't ready to be parents and they just want to, like, run away. And you're like, okay, girl, go ahead. Run away, love. You heard the song before? By Little Chris, yes. sad song. That's a very sad song. Damn. Damn. One of the other things that asshole. came up with the. Uh... Want to tell me what? what <laughs> oh, is... dude! Shout out, John Boy. I love watching this shit. What the fuck? What is that? Was that his ear or his nose? His fucking ears. His ear. They're having a ear rubber band pulling competition or something, or not rubber band, but just. Yeah, that shit's pretty vicious, dog. How? Have you seen the one that uh, fucking Dana White has? Oh, the slapping? The slapping? Have you seen I that? I want to see that. Yeah, I've seen it. Like, well, wait. Where I don't they know go if to that's sleep? Dana? Like, they get knocked out? Yeah. I, yes. I, I didn't know that was Dana White. That's though. Dana like, White shit. I've seen shit. some girls, like, on TikTok, they be doing some of that shit. Fucking, there's a whole fucking game for it on an app. Like, where you right? There's, like, the, the slap game. I've seen that on the App Store. It's crazy, That's though. crazy. Would you ever be in a slap? Fucking a sla- uh, slapper, but... I don't know. If, I don't know if I like like this. Fool went to sleep. Like you know what I'm saying. Like I'm I also haven't dropped. Punch. Yeah, yeah. Super fucking. They're they're straight up. What's it? Uh, what's his name? Contra. Fucking. Uh, what's his fucking name? Bald head that we used to watch when I was fucking eating Oreos and drinking. Iced oh, the Hodge twins. No, no, no David. No. <laughs> Comedian. Fucking. Joe Rogan. Yo, Joe wow. Rogan. Joe Rogan's amazing. Sorry. Damn. <laughs> now, now that I think about it, Bullet Kev does like like. Bro, do you realize I was watching Joe Rogan? We were watching Joe Rogan when we, we, he was getting 40,000 views on his fucking vlogs yes, or on his uh, podcast, yes or no? Yeah. When it was Joey Diaz. Yeah. And I'm, like, that's why the first, well, not to bring up anything, but the first time that I was on, what's his name's uh, interview or whatever, and I brought it, brought that up, it was like everybody was like shocked that I used to watch him back then. And I'm like, it, yeah, it makes sense. Like, Dude, I love you know. watching the, the stories about like the crazy animals and the fucking tribes. With like yeah. some random foods that he just found on the internet that just yeah. have traveled the fucking, the fucking craziest islands in the fuck. That's crazy to think that some people still don't know what the fuck the internet is. But back in those days, if you like back, look, bro, imagine you're watching Joe Rogan when he had 40,000 views every fucking um, interview or whatever, every fucking podcast. And you don't think he's going to be huge because the biggest thing you saw him on was fucking uh fear, fear factor yeah. like that like at that time i remember just watching so to me that's an inspiring thing or like russ those are inspiring ass people because like i watched it from like it wasn't happening to like it happened so to me i'm like there's times when i feel like i ain't shit and then i'm like bro like there's been people that maybe at that time they felt like they wasn't shit but they're shit like i don't fucking know you know i have a yeah, hard yeah. time gauging who the fuck like what the fuck? Like the other day I was I had no makeup on. I was at like it was like eight AM at like Walmart and I'm like just walking and someone like re- reverses their car and they're just like, you know, so blah 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 and all this shit and I'm just like like I was a little I'm not gonna lie. I- I'll tell you when like when I'm actually like kinda not in the mood. Um, this was one of the first times that I wasn't really in the mood. I was like, oh, hey girl, hi, how you doing? And um I felt bad for doing that, but at the same yeah. time like now we're human though, fool. I was like, like like yeah, like I'm like Yeah well, I mean bro, sometimes I had a bad I'm, morning, bro. And and I think us like what we do for a living is we 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 question ourselves a lot for like yeah and we're like ah oh, like damn am I really like like are you like like I mean sometimes I'll be like damn am I really funny or like I'm pretty sure you maybe go like damn am I really a good artist like yeah or like yeah I definitely go through those times and you just gotta snap out of it because we still gotta bring the paper home feed our families or yeah et cetera et cetera right but I definitely have those days where I'm like fuck bro I'm burnt out like yeah. And then I just gotta, gotta remember that I love this shit, and I'm and I'm and I'm blessed. But yeah, I definitely have those days. If I'm human, if I'm a fuck up. 
Yeah. I'm a or fuck culturally, up. Culturally, culturally, like you know, like especially being Mexican, like we have a good, we have a good way to like, you know, we make fun of each other. Yeah. Like we don't really, we don't really like show the props. I don't think the support is always there in the Mexican community. I think people think it is, but like sometimes it's a lot easier for like our people to hate on each other just because for it's sure, just like yeah. you know people want to be like the guy carrying the flag. Who's the top? This? Who's the main? This? Who's the best? This? And it's like, bro, really, we can't just make a whole ass culture of all of us like just yeah doing it and like we all collab we all fuck with each other like it's a fucking you know what i mean the puerto ricans did it mexicans can do it i feel like in the corrido world everybody's done it but i feel like within like the more urban mexican american world i think it needs to be yeah. a little more uh you know collaborative and, and, yeah not facts and i think it's getting better yeah i like, think it i think it's getting little better. by little yeah. and and hell yeah i think man. it used to be fucked up yeah, if I, I like I like I like the vibes now. I like the vibes now. I think it used to it used to be really fucked up because the real people that were making the money weren't even Mexican, so that was crazy. But at least now you got a bunch of Mexican Americans that are actually, you know, trying yeah, to get some shit dope. going. Damn, damn, we should go hog hunting. Would you be down to do some shit like that? Are you gonna eat it? No, I don't think you could eat those, right? You can't eat those. So that's what I'm saying. What? Oh, because they're oh, because they're pests. Yes. Bro, there's there's there be oh, rats around the hawk. ranch. Why don't we just fucking shoot them with a BB gun? Oh, that'd be cool too. Before we got in New York. No, we could like no. Did you know that LA is like the second rattiest city? I just, in the I know, but world? we don't see them like how people like people don't say that about LA. How they say it about New, you know how like in New York they make it seem like it's fucking just like yeah because they used to yeah well it was crazy in New York. I'm not gonna lie, it was really crazy. Master been, Splinter was walking around and shit. No, nowadays I was in downtown LA the other day and literally I'm just seeing them. And also that girl that was about to beat my fucking ass, which I told you guys, I told you on TikTok, but I didn't tell this story. So I'm downtown and I'm you know have you ever took a left and maybe like. You know, you didn't see somebody about to cross the street. So maybe yes, like, all the fucking you time. You stop. Yeah. Okay, but I stopped, right? So don't you think it's crazy when they be like, oh my God, you about to fucking kill me. And you're like, bitch, I fucking stopped. Like, if I was about to kill you, I would be a lot closer to you, but I wasn't. So whatever. I stop. I'm like looking at her. She's looking at me. She's screaming at me, cussing me out. Bitch, I'll fucking blah, blah, blah. I was like, okay, bet. So I waited. I turn. I go into a parking lot. I fucking park my car. I told you it's purple. I can't fucking you yeah. know, hide it. She followed you to your fucking no, car. No. I walk outside of the fucking parking lot. I end up on the street where the bitches actually walking towards me and now i'm like i'm about to get my ass beat it's been a long time since i've been like damn like i'm gonna have to take this shit or so i'm gonna have to up. i'm like damn and i'm with my tia i'm not trying to be embarrassed so i'm like and i was like okay should i cross the street or like did she see me yet but you know my hair was you know this color so it's like she knows who the fuck i am so i'm yeah. like fuck uh whatever i start walking and i'm just like all right if she starts finding me then that's what it is this bitch is just staring forward cussing She's just a crackhead. I was like, oh. Oh, skin roll like, crackhead. Bro. Straight up. I was like, mm, damn. This I was love on, those. It was on some like walking, like wa like what is it? Walking, walking dead. dead. Yeah. Walking dead. Like she's just going and all you got to do is like pretend you're just like going and I'm like, see her off the corner of my eye. I was like, yeah, I survived. Yeah, see, I don't want to fight no, no. I went to Las Perlas. I was, at Las Perlas, I saw some, I saw the whole thing happen. Some girls dancing, you know, some white girls dancing yeah. off beat. Some guy, white guy dancing off beat. Some other guy dancing off beat. They're all drunk as fuck. The off beats was hitting each other to the point where the girl just gets knocked back. And like, you know, at Las Perlas, there's like a, there's like a, there's like a thing. She hit her head so fucking hard. I was like, I thought I just witnessed a fucking murder. I was like, I literally like went like, oh, shit. And then the girl, and then for the rest of the night, I was just like, don't let her go to sleep. Like, had they sent her home? I was going to intervene and they looked like they wanted to send her home, but they were like stopping her. And I'm just like, I don't know. I feel like I got to She cracked her head. Cracked the fuck. And the, and the men landed on her. So it was just like cracks her head with the weight of just like, bah, and just like her head went like this. And it was a corner like this. And it's like her head hit. Oh, like that. Like, fuck. That putazo left a mark for sure. And she still wanted a party. Like she's just delirious. Like, yeah. And I'm like, I'm all right. Girl. Just give me a fucking ice pack. Right. But still, you know, when people walk weird or like they're shaking or whatever the fuck they're doing, it'd be crazy. Dude, you know what? I don't fight homeless people in, in downtown. You don't know what they got, fool. I don't either. I just thought, I didn't know that girl was homeless. I don't think she was homeless. I really just think she was like really off the shits. Like, Do you want to know what happened to me the other time? What? Um, so, I, so I used to have my office in downtown and I don't have it no more. Mm -hmm. And I was like pulling up to like a liquor store. To go by college, I was gonna meet up some little bitty at the thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me tell you, let me tell you, let me tell you the story, Snow. No, I got you. So, yeah. so I'm pulling up and I get recognized, but there's like there's like a liquor store like by Skid Row. So I just look super crazy. Like, and the guy's like, oh, which condom? And I'm like, fool, shut the fuck up, fool. 
Right. Like, you know, I don't want nobody thinking I'm out here fucking in Skid Row, but I was really on my way to my office. Just I forgot, so I stopped by a fucking, and it just looked crazy. I got recognized like mid condom interaction, and it just looked so fucking weird. I mean, yeah, that's that's at least nice. I got I got recognized mid. Um, I was buying Pepto Bismol. Um, in oh shit! Yeah, at the okay. airport. So, you know, that's more embarrassing. But no, I feel like is it? Condoms is like, bro, you're a dude. You're famous. Like, people know you fucking bitches. Ain't got these weird people. I would congratulate you. If I saw that, I'd be like, you know what? Good job. Because we think you're like, out here raw dogging people. Good for you. You taking sometimes, care sometimes. of. Look, see, that's that's not what we people want. to. We want to know you're being safe. But, 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 but that's when, but definitely being safe. <laughs> I'm just saying, just sometimes I'm, I'm not safe, homie. I live life on the edge a little bit. <laughs> you want a little bit of excitement, but you're still gonna for the exactly. most part. Exactly. No, but it just it was crazy because it was like a skid row. I wanted to go around like, yeah, I saw doing a bike cars and skid row. Like, whoa. Yeah, that would be crazy. But you, <laughs> it's not crazy that we always have to be careful of what somebody might post on TikTok because people want a story. Like I, the other day, you know, when I when I, I said that, I went out to the fucking uh, um, not scary farm. Where was it? No, it was Hollywood scary, whatever the fuck. And Universal. we at the fucking, yeah, Universal Studios. And then some bitch comes up to me and she like f starts filming me or whatever. And she's like, hey, you snow? And I was like, yeah. And then she's like, um, oh, something about my beanie. Because my beanie got stolen in Vegas and it became this big thing on, on, on TikTok. People were like making a big deal that I'm being a bitch because I stopped my show for my beanie. But I'm like, you know, I crowd surf. So it's yeah, like, yeah. in all my crowd surfs, like people don't steal shit from me. So in Vegas, somebody stole my beanie. Mind you, like, I, it's fine. But know. also no it was vegas the the orange one reno oh. was a different one yeah so in vegas it happens and i'm just like i stopped the show mid crowd by the way i'm standing on the crowd people are carrying me and i'm literally like bro give me my fucking beanie he never gave it to me so people are like she's being dramatic and blah 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 and i'm like bro i just feel like that's crazy i'm giving you a show i'm doing all this shit like i crowd surf i hang out with my people like i fucking do all everything i can and you're gonna steal from me at this point as a principal like why would you do that shit to me? yeah so anyway that bitch want to have a viral moment and I'm like, okay, so, cool. So she so, just asked you like. She goes, so, oh, where's your, did you ever find your beanie? And I was like, yeah, it was up your ass. And then she's like, ha ha. Like she didn't get the clip she wanted. So then she's like, hey, she t turns her phone off. She's like, I respect that, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, okay, cool. So I let that shit slide. But two rides later, Saw I'm her like, again. she's like two people ahead of me. And we're about to go into a scary house. The whole scary house, my eyes are just on that bitch. And I'm just like, so I'm with my son and people scaring me and i don't give a fuck i'm watching that bitch i seen that bitch go towards the bathroom and i went like like i'm like right behind her and i turned to high school for me i was like like literally i like grabbed her by a little bit of the waist and i was like go and because we it was like stairs to go in the bathroom and i was like go and then we go in the bathroom and i was like i just want to fucking talk to you because i was like let's just come and i have the video i was like let's just think about it i'm like i'm with my son i take time she asked me for a picture bro she literally stops me from being with my son she's like can i take a picture i'm a big fan i was like sure she goes, she's like, let me fix my makeup. Goes, fix her makeup. Comes back with this stupid corny ass way she thought she was going to go viral. I say my shit. And I'm like, bro, you stopping me from being with my fucking son to ask some stupid ass shit. Mind you, you didn't get your viral moment. You don't know what the fuck. And also Mexican women should understand why the fuck I was tripping about my beanie. She's like, I don't know who you are. I didn't even know you were a rapper. I just know that you made a big deal about a beanie. I was like, it's not a fucking beanie, you stupid bitch. I'm like, it's about somebody stealing from me. And you should support fucking women. So anyway, whatever the whole shit fucking happened. Oh, so she was she was like She was trying to make fun of me. Like she seen Yeah, me. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought I thought if it was like a fan that was trying to be funny, I was a little more like, okay, I get it. You're trying to be because no. I get that sometimes. But if yeah. you just you just wanted a reaction based on what you saw, yeah. Then that's cause because then now she don't know how you are. Yeah. Like she literally just thought I'm just like, oh, she's a whatever rapper. Yeah, yeah, and I, she she made a big deal of a beanie and, and I'm then, gonna make and a, then, I'm gonna go viral and then I'm seeing getting her a right reaction. Now. Yeah, because I think like, it's different, like let's say she would have said a joke that you said about the beanie, then it'd yeah. be like, Oh, you watch my shit, I Fuck support yeah. you. Like, but yeah, okay, I feel that. Yeah, cause people come up to me and be like, Hey boo, where's your bitch at that hits you? But it's because of a video I did, so I think that's funny. Yeah. But one, one time some fool came up to me and was like, Hey, what's your stripper name? And I was like, What? He's like, and like, yeah, like at the gym with all the homies, I'm like, hey, fool, like, like, hey, fool, like, it's cool, let's be funny, like, I'm, I'm like a fool, like, I'm a clown, but like, I get what you're saying, like, yeah. it wasn't like, you know what I'm saying? You yeah, can I, tell when somebody means well and somebody yes, yeah, funny, yeah, for sure. And when somebody just trying to make you, oh, like, you trying to, that's what, I, literally what I told her verbally, I was like, oh, you trying to make me the butt of the joke. I was like, okay, so where, like, where is it funny? Because now it's us in the bathroom, and like, we Mexican, 
we first of all shorty wasn't young she's not like a little young and like oh blah, blah, blah. like no you old enough to get this ass whooping in the middle of yeah. the bathroom and I, I think it's funny because all the people that i was with didn't even realize that that happened the only people who realized that i pushed her into the bathroom Your son. was my son and when i walked out he's like and I was like, no, it's fine. And I had to explain it to him how people need to respect and understand and she, entertainment and get this fucking ass whooping. And did she and did she mention it? Like uh like did she ever make a TikTok or something? No. I dare her. I have it I have our whole interaction recorded. I'm mm. not gonna make I'm not gonna post it to go viral. I don't give a fuck. I don't want I don't I don't care about that moment. But I dare you to say some shit so I could show how you, Who's the butt of the joke, bitch? Because you were scared. How you fuck. broke it down? She broke it down like, yeah. like, like, like pussy shit. I feel that. I totally feel that. Like, because people think it's funny be between you know the the internet yeah, the, and yeah. whatever. I think yeah, yeah. And, I, I, and and she asked me like she was a fan. She says, "No, I want to take a picture." Okay, cool. I'll always take a picture for a fan. But like, plus some bitch behind me had already said how my son was out past um like it's a school night and he's out and I'm like. And Shorty was, and you know what's funny is my son was like, yeah, she's out alone on a, on a regular night, so it seems like she doesn't have any friends. And I'm like, exactly. A bitch with no fucking wait, wait, friends. Wait, she said that where? Like in person? I was in line. I was in line. Well, one of my homegirls heard. Like, we were, it was all of us. And then some girl behind me said that she couldn't believe that I had my son out on a school night that late. And I'm like, it's Halloween. This is what time ho yes, Halloween Horror yes. Nights is out. So He's saying, 13. Life, fucking life's simple, dog. You mind your fucking business, let right. people do what they do. But Shorty got pressed by one of my homegirls, and now she want to act all fucking scared. And it's like, bro, nobody will be an asshole to you if you just, you want a picture? I'll take it. You want a hug? I'll give it to you. You want a piece you want of cool advice? Shit. You want cool shit, yeah. But if you want to judge me or say whatever, bro, now we now is a different thing. Yeah, now yeah. Claudia, my name's Claudia. Now you now you, now you pissing me off. And my son, or my, my girl at the time, I don't got a girl right now, but if I'm with a girl like that a I care about, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> if I'm with a girl that I care about or I'm with my son or I'm yeah, with my just, family just, time and place for everything for sure one time there was this domestic violence case what was it uh, you, would you, what the was hunger your domestic fucking, violence the hunger yeah. domestic, the hunger violence. domestic violence no, <laughs> no, no. I was the victim, was the victim I was the victim but the cops after the whole thing the whole rundown they asked me for pictures and videos and shit and I'm crying that's cool you got away with the kids <laughs> I didn't. She got locked up. I was still the vic like, what the fuck? What the fuck am I gonna get? That's away with? crazy, dog. I'm crying. Hey, Snow, real quick for the for the department, can we get a picture? <laughs> yeah, no, not for the department. But she's like, hey, man, I know this ain't the right time, but I'm like, th I hate when people walk up to you and like, I I know this ain't the right time, like you know this ain't the right time, and you still want to do this right now, like. I think to me the only thing that bugs me is when I'm eating. That don't even bug me as bad. Like, like one time it was bad. Like, and 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 I and ask anybody that ever took a picture of me. Like, I'm super just like, uh, uh, uh. but I've gotten the one where they fucking mid bite, mid fucking. And hey, dude, I'm like, oh, all right, yes. Let me maneuver. Cause you've then, never been with an argument with like in an argument with a shorty or something. You're trying to defend your case or something, and somebody's like, can I get a picture? And you're like, fuck. I've been like sock ripped. Me and my I mean, me and my bitch woke up fighting. We just eating like cause we're mad. Somebody asked me for a picture and yeah, I for sure been like, man, what the fuck? Or or sock um, ripped? No, no, no. Like yeah, like 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 my sock was like it was ripped maybe, and I was like, oh, I look crazy right now. Why did your sock get ripped in the? <laughs> socks, so fool, would... socks rip all the time. That happens. Like in the within, like you you fighting with your shorty and your sock rips. My shit got stuck to like something. And I pulled it, but we were out already. I'm not gonna take off the whole sock. I just didn't, you know. It was like it was early. I didn't think I was gonna get recognized, but then I got recognized. Yeah. No, or you know what? Um, but uh, fucking my little baby lives in South Central. Okay. And I was Shout going out South Central. I never met me? nobody from like no girl from South Central. Oh, you, they got you know lesbians what? out there. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Wait, I met one. Let me ask her where she's from, cause I know she was yeah, mad. Wait, I met one. <laughs> I went on a no, I went on a little like a little date or whatever, and she I could tell she was mad hood. She was like, yeah, and I was like. <gasps> I was like, oh shit. Yeah, nah, we, we, she we, might be from outside. Was, was it called? We're at the gas station and she went like, I'm gonna get something inside real quick. And she went inside and then when she was walking by, they were like cat calling, they were trying to walk up. But my windows, her windows is tinted because of me. Like, I was like, I was like, I was like, we're never gonna take your car unless you turn your windows. So she's like, I'm gonna turn my windows. And I put the windows on and I was like, hey, fool, that's my, that's me right there, perro. And he looked back and he's like, oh, what up, girl? Fuck with you, girl. I was like, hey, fool. And he's like, it's all good, my boy. I feel it. But he's like, let's connect, bro. I do music. Let me get an interview. And I was like, yeah, yeah, DM me, bro. I'm finna see it. I was like, 
And then she got in the car, like, what the fuck are you doing outside? Yeah. But it was funny, but I was it wasn't that serious. I'm not like a crazy boyfriend type shit fool. Like I'm mm -hmm. real cool. Like you respect mm -hmm. me, I respect you. Like you could go out with your friends, have fun with your even if you have a guy friends, you already know respect it. But I'm not tripping, I'm not going through phones, like Because you don't want her to go through yours? No, no, first of all, Snow, anyways. Yeah, shout out Snow. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm just asking what do you mean nah just cause you feel me like fool be on you know like don't go through my phone I'm gonna go through yours yeah, so, is it, so what was so confusing about that you said you don't go through phones I said because you don't want to go through yours no, okay no. yeah that's the fact yeah but it's because I get like uh, like like you know I, for, for you know we get important emails you feel me we got no you know. for me it's just like, like I, I went through someone's phone who went through my phone like even somebody like let's say we're not dating or we're not we're not no 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 we're not dating we're not in a relationship and they went through my phone and then they hurt their own feelings and then they wildin okay at some point randomly i'm like okay bet so uh okay bet so we both so what are we doing like why did i feel so guilty because i got a guilt trauma so for me it's like if you make me feel guilty now i gotta be like you better be squeaky clean because why did you just re like awaken this fucking random ass trauma that I got going on? You know? Mm, but, yeah, I feel like, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, maybe. The, I don't know. Yeah, I'm a piece <laughs> of shit. That's why I'm saying go away. I feel like, I feel like I'm like, I never told no, I never promised nobody nothing. I'm out here single. I was heartbroken for a year and a half. I'm chilling. Then when know? I met you, you were heartbroken. Fool. Shut the fuck. I'm like, Snow, you need a hug, fool. You were like, I'm good. I was I'm down bad, bad, boy. Yeah, I'm but like, yeah. I'm, I'm happy. You know what? I'm happy for what I went through because it was very real. And it also made me realize a lot Love of Love is real, dog. It's real, man. It made me it made me realize that that Bro, I was really, I went through it. I went through it. I was in love. Yes, like, I feel like we should have your exes in one house and we have a, a like a like a like a Jose Luis vibes. Fuck no. 90% of them still text. 100% of them still text me. Yes. No. Keeping them around. That's right. I don't keep nothing around. I'm then, cordial. So you don't want them to text you? No, they could like they could do whatever they need to do. Why are their numbers not blocked? Because because to me, no, realistically, two of them have a good relationship with my son. Right? Amazing. My ex my, my ex husband who has who is his father. Yeah. And then the ex after that. We're not calling him. We're not still, calling him. We're, we're we're talking about strictly just the, the ex after that still does to this day, buys him shoes, takes him to the fucking six flags, does all kinds of shit. So like it's more of a she's just more of a respect of like, hey, is it cool? Blah 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 blah. Cool. All right. And then my other ex, that's just more on some like like I feel like when it's been blocked, it just becomes like some internet shit. So now I'm like, bitch, if you got something to say to me, just fucking text it to me, bitch. Because at this point, yeah, yeah, you See, know, we, yeah. If I feel like we should do some Dos Corazones vibes. Fuck no, dude, that'd be sick, fool. No, no, I'm good, bro. Look, I've learned so much. When you really finally like, not on no like, you know, all this fucking weird guru shit, but when you really realize like who you fucking are, like me. When you look at that, you see synchronicity. You zoom that <laughs> shit in when I did this, and that shit is crazy. When you realize who you are, what you provide, what you do, how good you are at different things, you fucking kidding me? Do what you song know are we many, putting for this clip? Do you mean? Do you know how many people? Do you know who I need to fucking introduce to the good life? Fuck out of here! Like, what the fuck am I going back to? Somebody who hurt me, somebody who broke my heart. You, you had me and you fumbled me. Good fucking luck and good fucking riddance. No, you kidding me? Matter of fact, it's somebody's birthday tonight. You want me to show you what my text look like? Yes, yes, yes. Let me ask permission. A tornado flew around my room before you came. Excuse the mess I made. Damn, fool. Damn, fool, you should go to Peru and go to the Clilimpia, fool. There's a lot of love, hate in your, in like your realm, you know what I'm saying? In like what? your realm. Like, what is it called? Like your energy bubble? It's no, like, I'm fine. That's just hard. Your heart's like... Mine's just like this, fool. Yours is just like fucking. It's not. It is though, fool. You Why? Don't it. You're trying to project it on me. No, I'm not. It, it, you're heartbroken, fool. What am I heartbroken about? <laughs> you just fucking went on a rant right now. We're gonna put sad think... music on this clip, but no, I'm, fuck, I'm fuck, empowering fuck, one song women. To... I think it's very. Look, I'm proud of you. Yes, hands, thumbs up with a with a toe. People love it. They're fucking heartbroken too. <laughs> No, I think it's you that feels uncomfortable with the fact that, like, as a woman. Oh no, I don't feel. I, I was raised by all women. I don't feel any. As I'm, a woman, yes, I feel like I wish them well. Yes, to your exes. Yes. Yes. Okay. I don't have any. Like it just it no me importa. You know, like mm. no me incumbe. Like it's like for example, my ex husband. Like, can I show to his wedding? Probably. Yeah. But like, why? 
You know what I mean? It's like it's like I'd rather show up to open, one of your friends' weddings. <laughs> Flip up and bar and both. Yeah, but like at your friends, I might like meet <laughs> new friends. Yeah. Like why am I gonna go to the past and like dig up like for what? Sometimes I know the, what they are. Sometimes the past wasn't what it is in the future. You, you sound like saying? you sound like all my exes. <laughs> That's exactly what they were saying. <laughs> Sometimes the past isn't what it is in the future. I mean, I'm, I'm just like I just one of those it. things to where it was like, hey. I once was a piece of shit. I feel like people could change. You sound like my ex. That's what I'm saying. Like, I date people like that sound like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, whoa, no, whoa, no whoa, asshole. Whoa. Don't do that. I'm saying the people that I no. date sound like that. I know. I feel like. You know? And they'd be like, but what if I changed? But what if I did this? But what if I did that? I'm like, look, you showed what you had to show. We This was a great, you know, good luck. Love you. I, I will always hold you dear <laughs> in my heart. Go, I go, feel like we should have a reunion. Food. Go and learn. Go and go and take what you've learned from me, and 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 spread it. You, you know, know like you know what? Though? I'm like a guru. Like I'm like a source. Like I'm telling you, go take it and like teach new people. And like I'll take what I learned and I'll teach new people. You know, it's like that's what. Don't it is. trust bitches. No. You didn't learn that. I feel like I could. Tr- There's at least two girls that I've met recently that I trust a lot more. They're recently, like like with a time frame. Shut up! <laughs> I hate you. I'm drunk. No, you, you know, you know what does no? From when I first met you to now, your energy is so you, you feel. Like, I feel like you're more like at ease a little bit. I swear to God, on my mom. He was just calling me heartbroken and fucking. You, you feel could be heartbroken, fool. Heartbreaks make people. It made like it, you know. It's like, well, don't break you, make you. You know what I'm saying? I feel mm-hmm. like you're just like at ease a little more. Yeah, I'm chilling. Yeah. I don't. Think, I don't think there's there's much to like. It's like I I feel like like if I really push it into perspective like. I think I did what I needed to do in my career. Like, would I like to do more? Probably, yeah. Like, that would be great. But, like, as far as, like, I wouldn't have ever thought that I'd be where I'm at at all. Yeah. Like, it wasn't meant for me. You know what I mean? Nah, I feel that. I feel like when I started rapping, people wanted me to shake ass and be this and be that. And it's like, bro, I did it on my own terms. I am who I am. Like, that's dope. And I still, you know, make a good living. I can't yeah. say I'm broke. I'm good. We good. It's a good life, man. It's, it's like you. Life. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Good life. Yeah, good life. Yeah. Being yeah. funny, being funny, and you get paid, motherfucker. Like you get paid to be funny and be yourself. I kick it, fuck bitches, kick it with my friends, go eat, have fun, That's do my the job. Dream, bro. Do the dream, brother. Shit. What the fuck Clip else? It up for us. Bitch. What the fuck <laughs> else, bitch? And we and, and we come from a culture that got carne asada, tacos, birria, fucking burritos, tacos stuff? tostadas. You're mad buff, bro. Look at that. And even if we like If we're like eating And having a good time It's still part of the culture And we drink tequila Like tequila came from us Like what the fuck You could kick it with All kinds of cultures And be like Yup tequila Us Tacos Us Carne asada Us You haven't That that hot dog That somebody sold you right now At fucking Outside of fucking uh, Crypto fucking whatever Us Us <laughs> fuck, fuck you mean We out here And they be taxing For certain <laughs> shit though huh? Hey fuck. we have a white cloth I'll 30 fucking, bucks If I'm gonna fucking Make it rain on strippers I might as well Make it rain on the Fucking street vendors Shout Like street yeah vendors. man I ta- Look I tip them The same way that I'll tip Cause you know You be embarrassed If you go to a fancy uh, Restaurant and you don't Tip 20% You know damn well That they're gonna be Like oh damn Cheap ass bitch Mexican bitch So I tip them 20% but I tip my motherfucking street vendors too I'd be like hey You know if I like I get a fucking fruit cup or whatever Give you 20 bucks Keep that shit Like go ahead man Do your thing Damn that's lit fool How much Fuck are you a fan of strippers? Yeah I was just at Sam's on Monday With fucking uh, this I girl I did see that That's fucking You guys were wilding huh? You guys are wilding lately What do you mean lately? That's you're what all, I do you're, not, you're outside lately You know you like you're thugging, fool. I love it. I'm, I'm here for it. I'm here for I it. I always been. You just wasn't kicking it with me. You were on tour, fool. Bruh. Like, what? I was at Sam's. When, remember when Mondays was popping? Remember when AOD was popping? When this shit over here was fucking... Oh, I'm too young. When, yeah, that's right. You, yeah. But okay, back when... Uh, what, what's her name? Fucking um, Amber Rose had the fucking uh, Ace of Diamonds over here in fucking Hollywood and shit. Like, uh, you know what I'm saying? We was out here yeah. doing things. Doing things. Yeah, but shout out, shout out the strip, shout out the strippers, man. Y'all hot. In LA, all the strippers got like plus, you know, like two hundred k followers. You know, you can you can be like, all right, let me get your number. Look, it's a business expense now because it's like, let me get your number. I'm gonna book you for a fucking music video. You know, like now we got a rapport. 
Um, no, we got a report. We got a report. Hey, would you consider yourself a trick? Do you trick sometimes? I be tricking. Yeah, I be tricking. Yeah, yeah. I like that. I, I don't really be tricking like that, but you know. I'm, Why don't you trick like that? Like, I mean, like, like, what's the definition of tricking? Like, I'm Ubering you here and back home. No, fuck no, <laughs> no. I be tricking like, okay, like as a woman, I feel like I see them doing their thing, and sometimes. You know, because I travel all around the fucking country and yeah. internationally, and I go to strip clubs, and sometimes, you know, you see, like, some random creepo man, like, making a girl work mad hard for some, like, dollar, and they got to, like, stick it. Have you ever seen the guy that has to do all this and stick it in their thong and, like, do the most for, like, one dollar? And it's like, I don't like them working. Like, it embarrasses It gets me secondhand embarrassment to watch a girl do that for some creepo to do all that for one dollar. So, like, I like to show up on that creepo and just, like, throw money on her and, like, look at him and be like, yeah, that's I, what you're you, supposed you, to do. Well, you know what tricks me out? The fools that sit right in front and just drink beer and stare at them. Yeah, with, like, four dollars. I'd be like, you're a maniac, fool. Like, <laughs> there's something in your house that's not supposed to be there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's crazy. I don't trust fools like that. Yeah. But that's the thing. You got to You got to You know, I'm trying to show. I'm trying to. I'm trying to show up for women. You know, one stripper at a time. This. This is me. Women empowerment moment. You know, I'm trying to. Trying. I'm trying to support. I'm trying to support the sport is what I'm trying to do. I love you know? that. Shout out the strippers, you man. Know? Yeah. You know, I don't want them to feel ashamed and like creepo guys got to do the most and like I don't want that to become the norm. Yeah, now every sure. guy thinks like with one dollar because I remember I was in what was it? I showed up to New York. It was like mad late. And then some dudes in New York, I was in Queens at some strip club, and they're like, you're throwing your money way too fast. You're wasting money. Look, for $20, I can have them here for 30 minutes. Like, all you got to do is slow down and this. And I'm like, bro, that's crazy. Like, it's fucking 3 a.m. in Queens in New York. Like, bro, let these girls make their money and fucking go home, dog. Like, the fuck? Man, you're really for the people, Snow. I love it. Yeah, I mean, I'm also not going to sit here and fucking hella trick. I know these bitches are going back to their broke-ass boyfriends. So I'm like, <laughs> I'm not gonna, I'm not throwing that much, but I'm just still going to make a scene. I also am a professional and a connoisseur in strip clubs where I can make it look like a lot when it ain't really a lot. You know what I'm saying? That little $2. You know what I'm saying? No, 20, the 20 to $70 in fucking singles is going to look like I'm fucking flood if you fucking do it right. You know what I'm saying? You just got to know how to, you know, make a little, make a little scene. And then everybody else is gonna look at you and be like, "Oh, that girl over there with the with the blue hair, yeah, you got that fuck with that bitches. girl." Bitches. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then some of them recognize you. Then they go, "Oh my god, I'm such a big fan." And then take you me home. get their Instagram, and then you go, "Hey, I would like to put you in a music video." And then you got the whole thing. I don't take them home. I don't take strippers home. I'm alright. The most I got from a stripper was a calf massage, at eleven in Miami. I've told y'all that. That's it. And I had a bunch of strippers coming at me for that. Like, okay, they're not supposed to do that, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, girl, they seem like they love that shit. Like, what the fuck? I was with Jimmy. Jimmy was making it. Bro, that motherfucker. Umila? He had just the, the fucking plastic, just stacks and stacks and stacks and just handing out stacks. And we're just fucking throwing that shit. But I kept asking for, you know, I like Afro Latinas are like black women, everything. So I'm like inviting them over and then they're like kicking them out. And I'm just like, no, come please. So then they're inviting the girls they like. And I'm like, okay, well that's nice. But also like, what's up there? So I'm just like throwing money at them. And they're not coming. So then the girl's like, what can I do for you? And I was like, Dude, give me a fucking calf massage. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm getting a calf massage and I'm still grabbing the stacks and I'm throwing them over there at the, at the Caribbean women over there in the fucking <laughs> over there. I'm like, hey, girl, I see you. Shout out Dominicana, hey. Puerto Ricanas. You know what I'm saying? I can't wait to New York. Uh, I've been in New York, but once I get with like a Puerto Rican girl, I just want her to talk shit to me out there. Isn't that what we want? We want, like, we yeah. come, we're definitely Mexican, bro. We want that little abusive, shorty abusive. Yeah, I, I want the accent, fool. The accent. The Mama, huevo, te dije que dejando la casa. Aquí está con tu amigo, coño, puta, boo. I'm like, cool. Yeah, they do the little they do the little this to your fucking head and they be like, tu piensa que tu ca tu ca and you be like, ah. be like Yeah <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well girls that speak Spanish, the you get you get you get suckered in with the idea of it and if they don't speak Spanish they don't do that. But the ones that do speak Spanish they be like, Pero tu piensa que tu ca ca ca. Yeah, that's like, just amazing. Yeah. It's, it's a little sexy. Do that shit. Abuse. Damn, I gotta get a calf massage now, fool. Bro, calf massages are fire at the strip club. What? That shit. We never been to a strip club together yet. Bro. We gotta do it all for Hong Kong strip club. I've never been to Hong Kong. Neither have I. <gasps> I've heard about it. I've heard about it. I gotta go incognito though. You know what I'm saying? Just crack it off. No, I wanna go more. Bro, let's come up with like a random, like super incognito, like out like situation for me yeah. where like 
You know what I'm saying? Like, I'll just be like the creepy homegirl, but like nobody will even know. Bro, I'm down to spend, you know, the rest of the evening being like, oh, yeah, that's my homegirl. And then like the like everybody just be like, oh, your homegirl is weird. I'm down to be that person and just be incognito without being recognized. So you're not Long cracking sleeve. them with us? No, I'm, I'm good. I crack, crack what I got to crack. Oh, okay. So you're not down for the cracking. We're cracking. Like, like, we, like, like, if I were to go crack the hole with Hong Kong. Oh, no. No, 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 no. no. I just wanted to experience, but I don't uh. want to get recognized. That's all. Okay, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not no. cracking no, yeah, the hose. Yeah. I suggest y'all don't crack the hose at Hong Kong either. No, no, I'm with you. I'm with you. I was just, I don't know if people were suggesting that. I don't know. That's what I heard. <laughs> please don't crack them and please be safe. Yeah, 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 for sure. No, no, I, I, I never want to crack them. I want to be incognito just like you, but I'm just saying, like, I yeah. thought you were down we for the cracking. We thought you said it. We thought yeah, you said yeah, yeah, it. Yeah. We thought with your eyes you were like trying to say. Yeah, you you, he, he was definitely suggesting we crack the holes over there. Yeah, but I'm not if you're down to crack. I'm, I'm just I'm going based. I'm not off. cracking the holes. But, okay, yeah, but, no, okay, yeah, yeah. no, me yeah. to me either. Man. I don't think in Hong Kong they don't have a lesbian section, do they? No, they're they're just strictly straight Mexican men. I, I mean, I think they're going based off the money. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like I, we do what you want us to do. Yeah, like like if you want cat massages for hours, seventy five bucks. I mean, I think that's a good. Right, no, no. I mean, that's a good price. I mean, I'm not. Yeah. That's not cracking, right? No, that's not cracking. Yeah, that's, that's a slight massage. Massage, yeah. Nice. Yeah, nice. Yeah, no, I don't know. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm whatever you're on. <laughs> we'll give cat massages together. <laughs> I fucking hate you. I'm dead. Has it been an hour and a half? What the oh, fuck? It's been two hours and a half. I'm dead. <laughs> Shut oh, the I fuck up. And fix my apartment. Oh yeah, yeah that's just, right. You yeah, you gotta go you gotta go paint your apartment right now. Yeah, man. You gotta. I've been I've been out in the road all day, but I had to come, bro. I love whenever I come to your ranch. It gives me a lot of motivation, fool. Fuck yeah, no. Like when I walked in, I was like, ah. I was thinking of all the scenarios. I could, like let's just say if this was my home, I was thinking of all scenarios I could do here. Yeah, no, I mean that's have what a I bitch think. In one house, the other one in another house. Have a spot for the homies, man cave. You know, have a spot. Like, I was thinking about like, oh, I could buy paint on. Paint guns hiding in bushes. Some. We have some. And they shoot if the y'all, If y'all buy some paint guns and y'all want to have a paint gun shit around here, we can do that because we have a few. And I've been thinking about, but strictly to the tree areas. Can't <laughs> okay. don't shoot my house. <laughs> but like I'm paint, down. Paint that just washes off or something. Yeah, yeah. I think I think I think they do have the ones that just like they don't like stain. But I have thought about it. But people gotta sign a release that like if you fall and trip, like you're stupid. Like that's your fault. Like don't fucking be trying to sue me because you are stupid and you fell on something. Like that's your fault. So yeah, but um, yeah, fun. I want to yeah. do fun shit. Nah, you know? but yeah, I was thinking about all the dumb shit. Like, damn, my mom ran just walk around naked. That that's like that's no 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 that's, that's a real thing like 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 the homie like, Adam like, 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 and Eve <laughs> <laughs> no I'm thinking of like I bro I saw like articles before on Netflix and like Rafacado was just like with his like cock out rocking his cock out you know what I'm saying and I'm pretty sure girls every once in a while want to experience themselves like you know just breathe a little bit like now that I have my own apartment food it's up you know I love it's that up. for you private private setting black windows just walking around. When you have your your housewarming, <laughs> invite me. I'll, I'll yes, show pull up, them. pull up. Because after these shows, like I literally, I have like after the fourth. The fourth is my LA show. After that, I'm off, bro. I'm chilling. I'm in LA. Like you gonna find me in LA. Maybe I might like dip to a little vacation for a couple of days and then Ooh. pull back. A but, vacation. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> I, I'm here, bro. So I want to do some fun shit. We about to, you know. We about to turn up and shit. I'll go to your housewarming and whatever. Yeah, that. pull up, man. It's but you bomb. better pull up to my fucking November 4th show and be a fucking uh, chambelan. We got some, you know, we got, you got to help me spread the word. You already know. You got to help me spread the word. Anybody who want to show up is lit. But other than that, that's my last show for the year. I'm off. I'm off. Other than dropping music, I want to drop music and I want to shoot little music videos. Which, by the way, if you got some bitches, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, I'll shoot some over. Let's do some little VHS, like, little videos of just, like, let's say the music video is I go out with the homies. Yeah. And the whole music video is just turning up, party, fucking shots in mouths, fucking bitches stripping, smoking, whatever, burnouts, all that shit. Like, that's what the video is and that's we what the got video you, is. And like, we, that's what I want to do. All right, we got all that. The hoes. All that. Let's do it up. You feel me? So let's do that shit. Thank you so much for fucking coming through. No, of Officially. course. Always, fool. I love you to death. And by the way, Brown Bag is going to be at the World Trend December 23rd. Brown Bag. Live. I'm going to show up to Brown Bag. Yes. Y'all motherfuckers better show up to mine. I showed up to a... the Nova. The Nova was lit. 
It's always a collaborative event. Well, this time I'm at the Palladium, motherfucker. I'm nervous as hell. I told you. you I saw it, Eladio sell it. I'm like, bro, he's famous as fuck. Like, why am I here? I literally feel like they booked the wrong person. But fuck it. I'm here. I showed up. And uh, <laughs> it's going to be what it is. All right. Thank you guys so much. I got to show up back to Brown Bag. I got to fucking drop this podcast with Duno. Hang out. I love y'all. Thank we'll you so much. We'll see y'all November 4, bitches. Pop out. Ah! Esa niña no se aguanta, quiere todo porque el pussy sabe a fanta. Si la dejas por pendejo se te casa. Dale todo dos de lengua y una horchata. Si te alcanza, I'm the shit, huh? Are you catching what I'm throwing for a picker? Same bitch I always was, now I'm just richer. I'm about to shake it up and check the Richter. This a sticker.